Hi everyone and welcome back to The Sims 3. Today we're playing My Sims 3 Star World Legacy Challenge. Everyone in chat is saying hello and chat's already gassy. Nancy holding in for the intro. If you don't know what this challenge is, this was created. Oh, here we go. Here we go. All right, just let it all out, chat. Let it all out. This challenge was created by Florida here on YouTube and you just basically play through every Sims 3 Star World we just last stream moved to lunar lakes so if you are just joining us you've never seen this series before you're joining us at a really good part because we're starting something new today well i guess last stream we did but like technically we're getting into it today yes applause applause thank you i'm wearing by the way i'm wearing like a sweater you're gonna see me pull out this hand fan probably throughout the stream I love this sweater and I wanted to wear it. So um, it's starting to be fall time. It's still like 60 degrees in New York. Anyway, our air was born last time. Oh my gosh, our Lunar Lakes air was born last stream. So here's our little house. Now, before we get into this, I have some updates, guys. I did a thing. I did it. What did, what did Mal just say in chat? Mal, what did he just say? I'm doing that, but uh, okay. He's watching me on the toilet. Thanks, Mal. Mal joined us for last stream. That was fun. I'll leave a card in the top right if you didn't see that. Um, okay, two things. Two things, guys. Two two things to get through. Two housekeeping things. I I I did I did something. I did something. Can I show you what I did? I feel like I should. Every single time I've re-upload the YouTube video, in the description box, you can find this. And normally it was um, like right up to here and it was very outdated. Like Gabriel was still a child on the family tree, but I did a thing and I updated it. Yay. I updated the whole family tree. So this, the website I use is called The Sims Tree. They graciously sent me a pro version of this software. Um, it's not even software. You just go to thesimstree.com now i don't have anything to give away today but spoiler alert uh i probably will be working with sims tree in the future to give you guys away some pro versions of this website because it's made by a really small team of simmers and i want them to succeed and you don't have to pay for anything um so hopefully in the future i will have some codes to give away to you guys uh and yeah i don't have anything right now so I don't want to say too much about that. Maybe in the future, we've talked about it. I've talked about it with with them. So hopefully I can give you guys some, some codes away um, because I love this website. Like it's so well organized. People are asking what website is this? It's called thesimstree.com. So this link, this link right here, it's always left in the YouTube description. So if you wanted to go and see the family tree, you can do that. Go like my tree, it has 76 likes. Okay, go give me some more likes on my tree. But anyway, you can really follow the progression of our family tree like we started off with sage who had mocha and look i even added mocha on the family tree i know my my chat's kind of covering it but um yeah on the right side here you can see all of i'm gonna put this chat on the bottom left how about that that seems like a better place for it right now you can see all of our pictures we've taken throughout this this was the last picture that we had i'm dying this was the last picture we have with our founder sage oh also so cool do you guys see right here this is air no what is it called cloud these are hosted in the cloud so you can delete the photos off of your hard drive when you upload them to sims tree because they're here and look when you click on a sim if you have pictures of them uploaded it will show every single picture that you upload on here in a gallery format and you guys can all see these isn't that sick so you don't have to host them on your computer and it's all like located in the same place that's why i like sims tree and i know there's a lot of people that are like eh, paying for paying for a family tree for sims is kind of like they you know maybe they don't want to do it um i'm lucky that they reached out to me but yeah hopefully i'll have some codes to give away to you guys so you can get the you can get this for free facial recognition i manually added every one of these sims which was why i was procrastinating putting them in here how did you do the white background for each sim i just posed them in a white room and took a screenshot of it basically that's all i did so if you can see like i think 
on some of these photos i didn't properly like crop it so i think there was like thought bubbles <laughs> in some of them someone said our naming our babies ryan lion and dion was like so unserious <laughs> but yeah we have everybody all of our sims oh yeah and if you mouse over them it will show like the parents of each sim so for example iris her dad is not philip if you remember her dad is simon who was like a pre-made sim in uh what was the town we were just in hidden springs yeah little recap we start off with sage our founder she married dallas but not before she had two kids one of which with don lothario who i put in here can i can we click on him oh <gasps> we can oh my gosh all the info for don lothario is filled in like i filled in like all of his traits and everything like that i was gonna ask why you pronounce dion differently yeah his name is said a little bit differently and it looks and then we have breeze who was born to sage and trigger broke and then clem is the child of dallas and sage who's our heir for this generation and then we have drew evan and flora which are whatever we didn't carry on with them and then clem had gabriel we love gabriel everyone says that he looks like dr avery from Grey's Anatomy, tell me if you see it. I see it. I definitely see it. Here is him as a teen. Very cutie, very cutie. And then we have him as an adult now. Look at him all grown up. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And then Cassidy was a pre-made sim in Hidden Springs where we played. Her whole thing is there. So Hidden Springs, the weird thing about Hidden Springs is I think the sims in town that you see that are green are technically supposed to be fairies, but because of when Hidden Springs wasn't released with Supernatural, um, yeah, we didn't get fairies. So like all these sims you see that are green are technically supposed to be fairies, but they're not. So I made her a fairy. So we met her in Hidden Springs, and then she has two sons from a different relationship with this guy named Ian. This guy named Ian, which I filled him in too. I did my due diligence. And then we had Ryan, Lion, and Dion last stream. And Dion's gonna be our heir. As you can see, the line, you can see this line here, indicates our heir. So it's kind of where we're at. That's everything. That's a little recap if you have not joined us before. I'm very excited to play this challenge tonight with all of you. And okay, so that was the first thing that I needed to get a little housekeeping time. Um, and then I said I was going to download the Sims 3 store set of the Future Shock set. Hi, Nia. Future Shock Sims 3. Let me show you guys this set. And the reason why I bring it up is because it fits so well. It fits so well with this world of Hidden Springs. Like, it's amazing. Hi, Fabulin. <laughs> Fabulin says, also, hi, Maddie. Pooping in. <laughs> That's quite on brand for chat because y'all are just gassy. Hi, Day. How are you? How are you doing, like, Day? Just subscribed. Look I at this got set. It fits so well. Yeah, challenges really keep me, like, pulled into the game. <laughs> if I squint, I won't remember. <laughs> You're only on the that's crazy i don't even know how many streams have we had so i'm gonna replace some of these items with the future shock stuff yeah day's here hi day how are you graced us with his presence um okay wait what happened here what is going on i'm just gonna leave it as the default it's because i have covid i'm gonna delete this stove as well what happened with this kitchen i just realized like all of the appliances have this low on them will you have a cozy fault yes i was debating whether i should do it last stream but i was like no i need to wait a little bit further into fall it's only just been september so we're definitely gonna don't don't think i'm not we're definitely gonna do a cozy fall playthrough this this year i might even do it with my this family no because we're living in lunar lakes like it doesn't work in lunar lakes i'm sorry at least get the stencil remover. I think I have it. I have to enter a cheat to do it, though. Get rid of that pattern. I feel like there's countertops. Oh, there are future shock counters. Okay, we're just going to use these. We're just going to use these because this goes with, like, the whole... Goes with the whole everything. 
what's the next world that's a good question maybe it's monte vista oh lucky palms yes lucky palms is the new world also hi frankie in the youtube chat hi everyone in the youtube chat i'm not forgetting about you guys um emery i'm sorry you probably asked this when i was showing off my D, &D books asked if i'm the dm of dungeons and dragons yes i am well i was i was the dm of dungeons and dragons but my brother's taken over for the next campaign Monte Vista is very full vibes, yes. Do you have all the store content or what I just like? Well, just what I like. I don't put everything in. I think my game would crash and burn. No, that's a lie. I can I compress my CC with CC magic. And before you ask for a video on that, please go watch Florida's video. Like hers is like the best, most concise way you can possibly imagine. I feel like I'd be yapping for 30 minutes. Whereas her video is like super short and to the point. So go check out florida's video on cc magic because it is great cc magic is how you can compress your cc and organize it by the way if you don't know hi christopher how are you okay future shock living room set check i think there's couches too let me bring up the future shock sims 3. let's see oh there's cabinets let's grab those so i would never typically use this set so that's why i downloaded it because i know i would not use it you cannot place through a wall what oh because the half half um what is it called half walls they count as like technically walls i've been doing a marathon of viewing this series so I, I thank you i'm glad i'm glad people like it this is like it reminds me of when i used to play my legacy challenge but it's that was more loose because it didn't have like rules i was just playing through each pack which is crazy to think about i was playing i was playing sims 3 no rules or nothing just pure vibes girly pure vibes okay i need to kick him out of bed i think xcc magic to my laptop's bad specs and blur letter batter lattery <laughs> battery that's two seconds away from catching fire is still holding me back amanda i'm doing good i'm doing good i had a busy week let me tell you guys about this week i just had i had i'm in a scholarship program and they had us go to a meeting yesterday that there was one at 12 15 to 125 which is fine like an hour meeting chatting with the people in the program like that's fine that's acceptable but then an hour and a half later they had us go to the downtown where i live and had to go there i had to find street parking it's in kind of a bad area where they had us meet and i went to like this marketplace um which was fine when i got in there but it was like very stressful trying to find parking if you've ever been like maybe in your town or the town over you've been to a downtown area it's just not fun to street park like it's you have to parallel park and i am a terrible driver and i just uh, it was a whole thing anyway got that done whatever and they had us there till 7 30 at night at this market like doing group bonding activities so what the hell i had i was out of the house from like 11 45 in the afternoon to 7 30 at night group bonding activities till 7 30 at night i was like about ready to leave at <laughs> at like five or six o'clock i'm like i i just i kind of regret doing this scholarship but i'm i'm saving a lot of money and i get to go to puerto rico uh in april so that'll be fun with because of this scholarship so i'm excited to go to puerto rico it's completely free by the way because of the scholarship program the woman who runs it is like a millionaire so she pays for everything and i get to go to puerto rico which i'm excited about it's like a service trip though so we're gonna be shoveling gravel and planting trees and <laughs> all that kind of stuff I don't know how much of that i'm gonna like but i've never been to puerto rico before so it'll be interesting i don't actually know where we're going maybe san juan i don't know has anyone in chat been to puerto rico let me know oh look at this little glowy light someone said they're lurking have fun lurking lurk 
I think exclamation point lurk still works, doesn't it? I don't, maybe I muted the bot messages in chat. Oh yeah, it does. It does work. You're troubleshooting your Sims 3 sliders and mods. Yeah, you have to 50-50 that and that's like beyond what I want to do. You have been. Oh, that's cool. I think I think it is probably San Juan is probably where we're going. Isn't it like the most common tourist spot? Join an international program that welcomes students in my uni this semester and there will be a six hour welcome day next week. That's it's just too long. You know what I mean? Oh, team. Hello. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, save. We, we're saving. We're saving. We're saving. We're saving. We're saving. I'm sorry. That freaks me out too much. I have to save after that. That was weird. That was weird. Why did that just lag like that? I'm scared. I'm terrified. I am terrified. You had your first day of uni. Oh yeah, I had my, this is my, last week was my second week. So anyway, I had that on Friday, but it was just like a long day. Oh, Alex, I didn't see your message. Have you studied? Yes, I had, I, I said, I studied assembly last semester and I actually really liked it. It was very interesting. If you don't know what assembly is, it's like a coding language, but it's very bare bones. Like imagine computer, how a computer would talk if they could talk. That is what assembly is. It's like you're reading gibberish. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Maddie, can you help her with her go-to phrase in Portuguese? Oh, quantos anos voce tem? Yeah, that's my that's my go-to phrase right there. My go-to Portuguese phrase right there. That is that is my go-to. The only sentence I know. Oh, you're Brazilian. Well, you still speak Portuguese. How is everything so slow? Fifty rows, fifty rows for a single loop. No, that's 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 why. That's why it's, it gets so, it gets so difficult. Maddie's pronunciation is better than mine. Shut up. Be, be for real, please. Be for real. Ooh, look at this cushion. <gasps> that's so cute. Where do I get this? I mean, obviously it's from Tumblr. That's where I get, that's only, that only CC shopping place is on Tumblr. Okay. We did our little house reno. I replace some stuff with the future shock. Um, I need to get hold on. What else do we have in the future shock set? Let's see what else we have a kitchen set. Oops. I no. I just closed. I closed chat. Oh no. I, my, my mouse went to my other monitor and I closed out the chat. Hello, please, please come back. Please come back. Or why, why did you guys leave me? Oh, there we go. Nope. That's switch chat. I need to see both. I need to see both at the same time. Okay, we're back. We're back and better than ever. Sorry, I left you guys. It was my. It was an accident. I didn't mean to. Um. Okay, I'm gonna add the super sleeper in here too. What other pro programming languages? I have studied Java. I have studied uh, Python a little bit. I have studied assembly as i mentioned um c plus plus i'm currently studying i just started c plus plus so quite a quite a bit a little little bit of everything i mean that's that's not c plus plus is what i like so far like i like it it's it's easy to understand unlike uh assembly which was terrible c plus plus is diva yes we love her. Oh, look at this bed. The future shock bed is so cute. The not so routine machine comes with this too. So that's fun. I don't code, but we use it in my computer classes. Okay, you need to get up, girly. Get up. Yeah, C++ so far is my fave. Louisa Louis, Louis has a party starting. Python is easy too. Python I've only studied a little bit. I haven't seen like everything on Python. This set works so well in this town. I'm glad I grabbed it. Um, I, there we go. Hopefully that works. Is there a side? I bet there's side tables. I have not tried C sharp or C. But I know that if you know C, I know if you know C, you basically know C++. So it would probably be beneficial. Why is this too, too wide? I'm confused. C sharp is where the fun's at. I don't know. I can only study like one language at one time. I swear my brain is too small. 
I'm excited to be done though. This is my last semester at the college I'm going to, and then I'm transferring to a university. So we'll see how that goes. The university is like really far from me though. I have to drive like 45 minutes there and back. So that's gonna be audiobook, audiobook time. I'm gonna be listening to like hella audiobooks. I've been listening to A Court of Roses and Thorns, if anyone knows that series. I'm reading the first one right now. And it's kind of like, I don't wanna say cringe, but it's like very, people don't, people don't, dialogue doesn't happen in the way that it's presented in the book. Two hour commute? What the heck? That's too much. How is it in New York City? I don't know, I haven't been there in a while. I live in, I live in upstate, so I don't, I, I went to college down near New York, but I don't live there anymore. You're reading the second Akatar now. I don't know how I feel about it because people do not, like I said, the dialogue in real life, like it doesn't happen how it's in the book. It's very, it's very, I don't know, like fanfic. It reads like a fanfic a little bit, which is fine. Like I love me a fanfic, don't get me wrong. I'm not trashing, I'm not trashing it. I bought the damn book, you know what I mean? But I don't understand why it went like viral on book talk. I don't. I'm sorry. I don't get it. It's fine. It's a fun read. Um, but I, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe some of the sentence structure bothers me. I've never read The Butcher and the Blackbird. No. Thank you for hydration. I have two waters today. Stay hydrated. You read Akatar. Maybe it gets better. Maybe the first book, like... Everyone's like, you must read Akatar. Like, Akatar's so good. Everyone on Book Talk says that. I'm like, I don't know. Oh, the second book of okay, that's that's what I thought. I was like, maybe the maybe the first one. What the hell is that? What is that? A fairy folk jar. What is that? <laughs> it's got a bird on it, some mushrooms. What the heck? Um, I'm gonna put this weird, like vase situation i guess on the side table come on girly turn your ass around please turn around turn around every now and then i'm gonna what is that song favorite for dragon valley don't don't even christopher i just i know i know it's coming i just am sad i mean low-key i kind of want to work jen and john burb into the gameplay somehow bright eyed <laughs> is that a lyric in that song oh yeah it's bright eyed wait i didn't even know that that was what they said i don't even know what i thought that they said okay we need like a clothing rack in here because there's no dressers or nothing oh there is a dresser it's over here i feel like maybe cassidy would have extra clothes that she can't fit in her, fit her, in her in her dresser also i just realized they have no closet in here like all they have is a dresser where are you hanging your clothes up is everything wrinkly these are questions i need answers to is everything wrinkly when you take it out of the dresser it's oh it's bright eyes <laughs> i guess chad doesn't know the lyrics either <laughs> or ethan in specific ethan i'm calling you out I don't know why they are there though. What's the explanation? Oh, I don't know what, what the explanation for why Jen and John Berg are in Dragon Valley. Is that what they say? What do they say in that song? Turn around every now and then I get a little bit stronger. Turn around bright eyes. Okay, yeah, that, that sounds right. That actually does sound right. It's a karaoke favorite. Wait, Ed, okay, you're Filipino. I hear that in the Philippines, like karaoke is huge, right? Is Can you confirm? Like even people who like in the US, we would consider them like um, good singers in the Philippines because everyone practices singing and karaoke so much. Yeah, they can sing anything. I've heard that. I've heard that, that Filipinos are very good at singing because of karaoke. Can you confirm for us? Yes, it is, especially on my birthday. That sounds so fun. Like karaoke with your family. I don't know. I feel like my my family would be too would be would be too shy. Be too shy to, to karaoke. Where's like my futuristic plants? Where are they at? Hi kitty. 
yeah the filipinos who go on america's got talent or like those talent shows are always very good very good the philippines too it's so big that on regular weekend people are doing karaoke even on a normal day wait you guys said the same exact thing your messages are like <laughs> right next to each other that's so funny my neighbors would do karaoke that is a that is a karaoke classic i will say great song i love that one turn around every what is this plant go bananas house plant let's not <sighs> i kind of want to play animal crossing anyone else get like these random grooves oh my gosh speaking of games that i haven't played in a while um wizard 101 hello i don't know if you guys knew this but a cotton sock used to be a wizard 101 youtube channel yeah spoiler spoiler alert throwback thursday moment i guess but yeah i'm playing wizard 101 again because it's free for like the next couple days everything is free in that game and normally it's like a paid game so it's pretty cool okay here's our new bedroom how is it is it cute what do you guys think i think it's much better much cuter space i'm not even gonna bother actually i'm, I'm gonna add a, a tub in here or a shower i wish i was good at karaoke but everyone in sweden is shy i hear swedish people are very tall and and good looking i.e alexander skarsgård do you know who that is alexander skarsgård he's he's my favorite swedish person persian persian i've been in my wow era dude they don't even don't even i will i will get addicted to wow too i i remember my first introduction to wow was when i was a kid my babysitter's son had it and my account was named paladin girls because paladin girl wasn't like available so we had to add an s at the end and I don't remember the server I was on, so if you're gonna try and look me up, I don't know. I don't remember what server it was, but Paladin Girls, that was my first character at the ripe age of eight years old. Lost on Sims for Switch, great. I'm excited, I'm excited for it. I don't really have, I don't even play my Switch anymore, so. I feel like it's gonna be a very cozy type game, so that's cute. I, I really need to use my Switch again, but there's just like, oh, I know Wizard 101 is getting put on the Switch too. That's fun. Hi, Bowflo. I don't know if this is a bathroom. Did you have a transform mice? What is that? Transform mice? Scars guards are mega famous in Sweden. Well, for good reason. Have you seen Alexander Scars guard and Bill? Oh my God, I can't. I can't not talk about Bill's Scars guard. My God, that man is beautiful. It's a game of rats. I've never heard of that before. I love them. I are they still like relevant? I don't know. I know Bill Skarsgård is because he plays Pennywise, but Alexander Skarsgård hasn't done anything for a while, and I'm crying because he's literally. I have such a crush on him because of True Blood. Have you seen that, Dahlia? True Blood. He's in that show, and it's like he is so. He plays a very hot vampire. Delete. Wait, is your name? Dahlia and I've been saying it wrong or Dahlia wait how do you spell Dahlia like the flower Dahlia flower oh <gasps> d-a-h-l-i-a Dahlia why does that look like how it's not spelled I've never heard of transfer mice I have seen true blood they're like walking Greek gods. No, they are. They're, I don't know. I don't know what is in the water in Sweden, but why is everyone so tall is my first question. And my second question is why are the Skarsgård brothers like, they look like they, I don't know, were, were handcrafted by God. <laughs> like just beautiful, beautiful men. Oh, Dahlia was taken. Okay. I understand now. So it is Dahlia. Hobo, I never played Hobo. I did play Club Penguin, did play Toontown, but my... <laughs> also, why are you so good at Eurovision? <laughs> European moment. I'm gonna have this polo bar outside. Kaylin and, Kaylin and Laszlo? What is that combo? I still play Hobo. The only person I know, um, only YouTuber I know that plays Hobo is uh, Life Simmer. She was like obsessed with Hobo. 
Pop Topica I played, but it wasn't like a game I played at home. I always played it like on the school computers when there was like downtime and stuff. I never sought, I never sought it out because I was playing World of Warcraft on my brother's old laptop or like, uh, I don't know, that, that sort of thing. Wizard 101 was a huge influence in my childhood though. But yeah, if y'all if y'all want to get back into Wizard 101, you can. They're doing a free tr uh, membership until the 9th. And it's you don't even have to like enter in any information. You just like literally log onto their account, load up the game, and you have the membership for free. It's amazing. Wizard One, I I will still, you know, Wizard 101, like the lower levels are really easy and like obviously made for kids, but when you get into the really high levels, it gets so hard. I thought it was over. Wait, was there 101? No. Wizard 101 is thriving. Wizard 101 is thriving. Paladin was my favorite class in, in World of Warcraft. Um, let me snuggle. Okay, so we're gonna deal with deal with these triplets to stream, so I'm so sad. I've never played Free Realms. I know what it is though. The baby's crying. Sim Social is, yes, I do know what that is. Me and my sister used to play back in the day on Facebook. Oh, I meant the free thing. Oh, no, it's it's still free. It's free until the 9th of September. Uh, snuggle. I was being a boy mom on the moon, I know. I don't want to be a boy mom. Let's see if they can use these fridge. Let's see if it's like a glitched up piece of CC. Hopefully not. I started playing WoW when what is what is BC when BC came out. Mage was my shit. I know it's in, it's an expansion, but which one? BC. A oh, burning crew. Holy Thoreau. No offense, but you're old. That came out when I was a kid. When I was like nine years old. Holy. I've heard people that met their spouse on World of Warcraft. You're playing WoW right now? How many of my audience plays WoW? You're in uni. <laughs> when was that? Wasn't it like 2009? Uh, Burning Crusade. When did that come out? People say that that's the best expansion, right? 2007! I was six years old. I remember that coming out though. My brother was all over that. He was, he was in high school at the time. So he must be my brother's age around that, around that age, because he was in high school. <laughs> I met my wife in the blank. I haven't met her yet. <laughs> what is this big ass lamp on this table? This needs to be a little bit smaller. I didn't exist in 2007. That just made me feel old. I did like tycoon games. My favorite was Roller Coaster Tycoon. And my mom gave me, I like begged my mom at the book fair because they were selling Roller Coaster Tycoon at the book fair. And I was, I begged her to let me buy it. And she gave me the $40 to buy it. And I was so happy. I still have, I still have the box, the game CD in my closet from back, back in the day. I, I reached unk status. I'm old. I love Rollercoaster Tycoon 3. I think this is the one I had. I can't remember. I need like a less crappy lamp on the table. I guess that's better. Okay, what are we doing? We're gonna play on speed three to get through this these kids uh, being babies because I can't stand the baby life stage. I'm sorry. At least they're not tied to a crib though, right? That's, that's the one thing I will say. Oh. He's gonna take care of. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Take take care of. You need to go to sleep. <gasps> He's stuck. Oh no. Oh no. Let me pull the bed out a little bit. If you can sleep now. Yes. How about you? Yes. What? Oh, he's he's okay. He's 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 good. All right, go get, go to work. You gotta go to work in two hours. So those two babies are fun. Yeah. Toddlers in the, yeah, the toddler cry is like grates on my grates on my ears. 
Christopher's gassy. Christopher needs a, a papaya enzyme for his stomach. <laughs> Remember when you had problems getting Cassie pregnant? Yeah, now we have triplets because someone in chat told me to get her fertility. You know, honestly, I feel like the fertility treatment did it though because it was after we got her the fertility treatment that she got pregante. So I don't, I don't know. You do need it. <laughs> My mom always says if your stomach is upset to eat a papaya enzyme. She's a nurse, so I guess I have to take her word for it, but <laughs> I feel like that wouldn't do much. I wish I could have like a real papaya. I don't think I've ever had like actual papaya. I don't live, I live in like the coldest freaking climate ever. Yeah, I sent the kids to private school. I don't know if it went through though. I don't know if it went through. I guess we'll have to see. Did it go through? Do I have to sign them up for it again? They should be leaving today at 9 a.m. We'll see. I love papayas. I wish I could have one. What does it taste like? Play catch? Oh yeah, he's going to school today. Nice. 9 a.m. 30 more minutes. Waiting for them to leave. All right, so Dr. Avery's at work. It's so funny. He looks like he's Dr. Avery. And that he has to be a in the medical career too, per the per the rules. I love that the generations came with a way to tempor temporarily get rid of the kids. I feel like EA was cognizant of the fact that raising kids is annoying in this game. Some papayas taste like old stinky socks to me, but my dad loves them. I've had like dried papaya, never fresh. It's like very sweet syrup, huh? If I ever go to like a tropical place, I'm going to Puerto Rico. Do they grow in Puerto Rico? Probably, right? I don't even think they sell them at gro in grocery stores here because it's just I don't think any produce grows in New York <laughs> like it would probably be terrible <laughs> nasty nasty produce maybe corn we have a lot of corn fields in in upstate New York oh they're leaving thank god where's my sweater from it's from Hollister I must have it in blue I tr I tried to get this one it was sold out for so long I'm like all right I'm gonna check in a couple months and it was back in stock <laughs> They need to make like more like cozy. So I feel like Ariana Grande with my hands not showing. Like Kiwi, I like Kiwi too. I did see the new Sims 4 death pack. I did, that's crazy that they're adding deaths in a pack like that. Moment of silence for Sims 4 players. I'm sorry. I'm sorry they're treating y'all like this. That could have been a free update, right? New death types. Or work, or like, I assume it's probably gonna have funerals in it. Why couldn't they work that into something else? You know what I'm saying? Sims 4 is like, how many features can we spread across five different packs? Speed run. Bro, I do, we do have an Asian market where I live, yeah. I could probably try and see if they have them there. It's like out of the way. We only have one. I live in the I live in I live in the upstate New York. If you if you know if you live in New York, you probably think that upstate New York is like cornfields and hillbillies, and you're kind of right. A barn, a singular barn, one barn. Can I get my game PC? Yes. You don't bother update. You don't bother updating the game anymore. Oh, the kids are gone. Thank God. The next time I restart the town, I should have restarted the town before they left because now I'm going to. I'll say New York equals Albany. That's pretty accurate. The Albany is very far up, but there's a lot beyond Albany. I haven't seen snow in seven years. That's crazy. We got very little snow last year here. Why? Are, what? What is with this dog, girl? What? Please, go outside. Please go outside and pee. Pee. I don't even care. Pee on the front step. I don't care. How come the dogs can't take care of themselves in this game? I don't understand. Can you eat this on the ground? No. Um, where's your chew toy? Didn't Pinky get like almost perma glitched last time? Okay, Gabriel got a promotion. How does he only work till 2 p.m.? That's crazy. It's so early. Nine to two, he gets out at two? Like what? 
What an early shift he, he gets off at. Let's go and have him listen to a, he wants to learn gardening, which is very interesting. Very, very interesting. Oh, I am still looking for Lunar Lakes houses. I forgot to search. I forgot to look. I said I was going to. Hydration, thank you. Pinky is in the in the family tree. You guys wanna see? Let's see her. Where is my family tree? The Sims tree. Can I look at it like this? Ah, oh, here we go. Okay. Pinky is right here. Pinky's our Pinky's our doggy. It even has her traits listed up there. I took a picture of her. My state is kind of like New York. The metro, the metropolis is huge, and the rest of the state is an amalgamation. That's a that's a hard word to say. Amalgamation of small cities. Is Mocha there? Mocha is on there. What vegan Indian meals do you recommend? I'm going to a new Indian. My favorite, um, actually, I don't think it's vegan. I think it's vegetarian though, but it's called Malai Kofta. And it is basically, look it up. It's, let me show you. I'm just going to show you the, I'm just going to show you the dish. It is so freaking good. I've never had a flavor. I've never had a flavor like Malai Kofta. This is it. So it's like, I can't zoom, no, I can't zoom in anymore. It, it's like these, I think they're maybe deep fried, but they have, they have like potato in them, a bunch of vegetables, and it's in like a cheese sauce. Yeah, so this one be vegan. It's, it's like a cheese sauce with, it's like a soup basically. And you can dip, you can see naan over here. You use it to like shovel the deep fried potato balls, the potato balls. In them but yeah this isn't vegan but it is vegetarian it's so good i love indian food my mom texted me the other day and she like there's this coupon for our favorite indian i've never i i've had indian food down in new york city too and you would think like a big city like new york would have amazing indian food but this my small town run downtown in upstate new york has better has this indian restaurant that I've never had flavor in any other Indian restaurant, including down in New York City, which you would expect to have good Indian food. My small town in upstate New York has better Indian food than New York City, I guess. <clears throat> Is it very spicy? No, it's not. You can add, they can, they always ask me like, do you want mild, do you want medium? And of course, um, moment of silence because I go for mild. I like, listen, I, I don't like not being able to taste the food because my tongue is on fire i want to be able to taste the flavors i don't want it to be like numb does anyone else feel like this i feel like it's gonna that's gonna be a a, a small uh controversial opinion is spicy food is just not it you know <laughs> mold on your mini donuts the ones you get from like a gas station i hate spices i also need to taste the flavors i have a terrible I have a terrible tolerance to spice, really. I do. So white person of you, Maddie, I know. I know. I don't mind spice, but if it's to the point where I have tears and I like can't feel my tongue, like that's too much. <laughs> yeah, you're getting clipped. <laughs> I will like I like talkies. I will eat them until I get gastritis. I've never had talkies. I know what they are, of course, but I just never had them. They don't feel they aren't appealing to me. They're from Costco. Not the not the mini donuts from Costco. I feel the same way. I don't understand people that like spice so much to the point that their nose starts running and their eyes get watery. Like what? Why would you want to do that to yourself? Like you can't even taste the food at that point what's the point like well, what's the point of even eating just like go eat a chili pepper if you want to cry as you're eating food talkies are so mid talkies have taste they look like a while ago the um what's that company that makes the tortilla chips anyway that one tortilla what is that company tortilla chips the, the big the tostitos tostitos if you, we don't live in America, this is like the number one 
tortilla chip brand here and Tostitos did a roll tortilla chip Tostitos. Let me show you guys this. These were so good. Oh, here they are. Oh my gosh. These were so good. And I cannot find them ever again. They're like rolled tortilla chips. Do you see this? And you can dip them and it like goes in the middle of it. Oh my gosh. They discontinued them. Why would you do this? They're so good. So freaking good. Why would you do that? Loki, they were probably like really annoying to produce because you have to like roll them and probably have someone manually like roll them on like a conveyor belt, which is what maybe why they were discontinued. But oh my gosh, so good. Aluri, I'm glad you know what they are too. Like people, we need, we need to bring them back. We need to bring them back. My mom was like, I looked everywhere in the grocery store. I could not find them. Yeah, I think they discontinued them. So sad. You unlocked a memory with us. I found these here in Europe too. The rolled ones or just like regular Tostitos? Regular Tostitos are like whatever. They don't taste that different, but the rolled, there's something about the rolled tortilla chips. And anyway, what reminded me of that is Takis. Takis are rolled like those tortilla chips were. I, I feel like I wouldn't love Takis. I'm not, I'm not a huge chip person. I'm not. Oh, the rolled ones. We're in Europe. Yeah, we're in Europe. Oh, I like how he's, he's freaking mopping up the pee. Okay, I'm gonna have them go woohoo because she, because Gabriel wants to woohoo with his wife. I want to eat the bathroom. It reminds me of a really good cupcake. Moment of silence for Lord. Game auto saved. Why is it? I don't know why it's saving without asking me if I want to save. Like, what if I didn't want to save at this exact moment? You know what I'm saying? It didn't even prompt me. Sometimes it does this. I don't know why it does this. Like, sometimes it prompts me, sometimes it doesn't. Like, why? No, get your ass back here. No, no, no. Get your ass back here, Cassidy. No! Get sh sit. Sit on the bed. We're doing this. <laughs> We're doing this right now. Um, woohoo. Woohoo! One thing Sims 4 got better is bed woohoo. Wait, how is it different? Real question, how is Sims... I guess I never noticed any difference. I haven't played Sims 4 since that last stream. I was like, I'm gonna download some mods and CC guys and maybe play the Sims 4 on my downtime. No. <laughs> no, I just, I just didn't. <laughs> I bought the best brie. The best like cheese I've ever had was when I went to when I went to France. Uh, there was really good goat cheese that my French friend put in a salad. Like you would think goat cheese in a salad is weird. Like as an American saying that, it's just like why would you put goat cheese in a salad? It was really good. It was really good. And I got I tried to get goat cheese from Aldi and it just didn't it didn't hit the same. Sometimes all these products in America, like I know all these in other countries is really great, but sometimes I feel like all these in America is really hit or miss. And the goat cheese was not it. Fitting mods in Sims 4 is daunting. The games I play are so old that it doesn't matter. Oh, Alex, you're from France. Oh, I think you've said that, haven't you? I knew that. Chris Langrab. Okay, I'll become friends with the Langrab. I can't really see Gabriel becoming friends with the Langrab, but maybe. Hydration, thank you. French cheese is so good. I went to the import section of my local market and there was a new brie that I haven't seen there. It's so expensive though. Upstate New York has a, a chain of um grocery stores is called Wegmans and that's like it's like a really nice grocery store I think they're only in New York state though I think there's one in New York City as well I don't know I thought I thought that there was anyway they have like a whole cheese section but it's always so expensive like buying cheese when it's on sale oh he's just eating rotten food okay go back upstairs and go to sleep 
Oh yeah, Wegmans in Virginia. I think it's a East Coast thing. But it start it started in upstate New York. My upstate New York moment. I'm proud to be an upstate New Yorkian. Or at least I know I'm free. Like first, I don't want you to be doing this for an hour and a half. Come on, girl. Wegmans is so bougie. It is so expensive. Like I got I went to Wegmans two days ago to get taco stuff for dinner and four things were like $60 and I was actually sitting there with my mouth hanging open like how is this so expensive no none of the kids are fairies I'm really sad about it sir stroming and reindeers what do I know about Sweden I know everyone's really tall um the Skarsgård brothers are attractive and they're from there I think Swedish people aren't they like usually got blue eyes and blonde hair like Viking, Viking type beat. Is that right? Weren't the Vikings Swedish? Or didn't didn't the Vikings settle in Sweden? I don't know. Some something like that. What else do I know about Sweden? Uh, meatballs and IKEA. <laughs> meatballs and IKEA. Are there new clothes in the store set? No, it's just furniture. Oh my gosh, these kids have been crying for like hours. Give bottle. That's about it. Isn't it snow a lot too? Snow. Seems like a nice country though. Nice place to live. I'd visit, I'd visit uh, Stockholm. Wait, why is Stockholm syndrome called Stockholm? Is it because that's where the syndrome was uh, given a name? I wanna know the history behind why Stockholm syndrome is called Stockholm. Not the meatballs and Ikea. Yes, that's about it. Why does this dog keep like not going outside to pee? I'm so confused. She's also very sad and lonely. It's about 28 degrees Celsius. Minus? That's like negative. What is that? Negative 28 C. That's like, I'm going to guess negative. I'm going to guess that's like negative 15 Fahrenheit. Yeah, it's like negative 18 around there. Around there. Around there. Named at named after a bank robbery. And so, oh, that's interesting. That history. I'm I'm gonna assume they took a hostage, right? Whoa, that's so interesting. Where that word comes from. It's 23 here, but it's so humid. It's like, what is the temperature here right now? Let me grab my phone and see. It's really nice. It's like breezy here. It's only 58 Fahrenheit. What is that in Celsius? 58 F to C. 14 Celsius. It's so nice out right now. That's like perfect. Apparently the hostages attempted to protect the robbers. Interesting. And the hostages in the end wanted to protect the robbers. Whoa. That's so fascinating. I mean, it's sad, but it's fascinating. It's 110 degrees here. That sounds disgusting. Wait, didn't you say you lived in Vegas or something? Miss Feet TV? Or was someone else? Someone said they were in Vegas. It's 100 degrees in California. 55. Okay, 55 is nice. Yeah, I like it. Oh, can you stop eating that hot dog? I live in California. Okay, that makes that makes more sense. I love, I love, I love sweater weather. I'm in Ontario, so my weather is about equal years. Yeah, I've got like the same, we got the same climate. I'm, I'm right on the border of Canada, so it's like, it's like the same temperatures. Oh no, Pinky's gonna get taken away. Okay, go hang out with your mom. Go hang out with your mom, Pinky. I'm so bad with taking care of pets. I am so bad with it. It's just like they take so much routing to get to the pet. It's just like, I don't want to take care of it. I'm sorry. Can Americans just cross the border to Canada? You need to bring a uh, enhanced license. But other than that, or your passport, either one. Other than that, yes, we can just drive right across. I've been to Canada a couple times. 
all this boy household is actually crazy i know oh it's their birthday thank god it's the triplets birthday oh my gosh why doesn't this smart sensor work okay someone last stream said it only fills when the dog is hungry the dog is hungry hello it doesn't it doesn't work like i don't understand this this smart sensor you add a smart sensor to it it doesn't work like what the heck i'm better off just selling it and getting a regular a regular bowl because this is just not working driving to another country is so foreign to me australia moment it's like brazil and uruguay you don't even have tolls you just walk to another country oh look at the food in that bowl it looks so high quality don't get too close to it and you can see it's flat <laughs> it's like so high res though interesting i downloaded that automatic pet feeder from that one place and it's not showing up in my builder buy hmm it shows up for me and that's where i got it from so i don't know it just like doesn't do anything like it doesn't it doesn't auto feed it doesn't auto feed them okay so the triplets birthday is today i really want to explore this town a little bit more no you don't have to unlock it, it should just be ready oh auto save again i don't know why it's not even asking me anymore if i want to save it's just like doing it it's just doing it i have a piece of hair on me i can't stand that one thing i will say about this sweater is it picks up hair like crazy i can't stand the feeling of when you have like a strand of hair on you oh it's so bad it's so bad birthday in the park oh we do a park birthday we need to buy baby carriers we have so much money though that's one thing i'm playing the sims 3 like couple generations in you will be loaded shout out sweet summer for the baby carriers i want like a multiple i want a stroller with multiple seats in it for like multiples you know multiple for multiples yeah that was redundant anyway i can't use it yeah it doesn't work anyway so you're not you're not missing much although it is a it is a good idea i just wish it worked a tandem bike but a baby carrier literally i need that sweet simmer where are you we need you we need you on that pronto okay so maybe we do a party today go to the summer festival we could go to one of these memories of hidden springs because we just maybe we just came i mean we did just come from hidden springs so maybe we go to the memories of hidden springs lot that seems cute doesn't it that seems very on the nose oh look wait how are these the future shock set i'm so confused wait are these from lunar lakes how is this in 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 this lot because i didn't change this these are from the future shock set i thought but it's in a dlc world so i'm a little confused a little, little confused oh repair the stereo okay uh, repair the stereo okay so does it put it in my household inventory yes it does all right we're gonna put this not outside because it will break again if i do that um let's go put it right there at the front door and then she can go repair that Oh my gosh, the babies are crying again. Can't stand it. This is why I did not want to get fertility treatment. It was going to be terrible. I'm Cassie. I'm pla I'm happy Cassie didn't get pregnant again, though, because I did just woohoo. I played both Skyrim and Baldur's Gate. Yes, I have. I didn't finish Skyrim, though. Um, When I was a kid, I used to say that's Oh, she wants to woohoo with him down, too. When I, when I was a kid, I used to say Skyrim was like too much. Like it was too, I didn't understand what was going on. There was like so much, there was so much happening. I was overwhelmed, I guess. So I never played it up until I was actually in the past couple of months, I started playing it for the first time. we are going to replay since patch seven is released for Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate got another patch. I thought it was just like a modding toolkit that's what that was oh my goodness this is so annoying take care how is it already 6 p.m 
Did he sleep? He slept the whole damn day. Oh my goodness. They both want to know who was each other too. They added evil endings. Oh, that's fascinating. Okay, so my my Enros relativity is on default. So I'm a little confused. Um, we could put it on 23, which is what I had. I think I had it on before. Makes the day slower, I think. Should. Yeah, 0.62 times the normal speed. Okay, let's go. We're going to go to the park. Put in carrier Dion. Put in carrier Lion. And then we need to grab one of the babies with in our arms. Ryan. We're going to grab Ryan with our arms. Go hold. Go hold him. And then we're going to have her head on over to the Memories of Hidden Springs lot. Look at her. She's got one on the back, one in her arms. She's just all about efficiency. <laughs> She's in mom mode. I love that for her. Look at this. She's got one in the baby carrier and one in her hands. I've never done that before. Yeah, mother is mothering, actually. That's so cute. I wish I could get like a foot, but it's at, let me see. Oh, she's happy. Look at her though. She's happy. Just my phone because I have to cook. A man got to eat. I had, um, I make this like ravioli dish. I don't know. I just throw a bunch of stuff in a pan and kind of go crazy but it's ravioli with uh diced onion garlic spinach and cherry tomatoes cut in half with a little bit of butter and olive oil and like salt and pepper and red pepper flakes and paprika and it i don't know a little splash of splash of lemon lemon juice and i've been making it and like my mom and her boyfriend love that dish when i make it I'm gonna make you hungry, I'm sorry. It's good though, it was really good. Okay, you need to put him in the carrier and then we're gonna go over to the Hidden Springs. No, nope, that's Twinbrook. Go over here. Um, Stay, stay. Oh, is that her? I hate when this happens with this. Where, where did they go? Oh, they got reset. Oh my gosh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best not to lose my freaking minds. Hi, Roxy. I'm gonna do my best not lose my freaking minds. I'm gonna do my best. All right, I'm gonna do my best. We're gonna take deep breaths, take deep breaths. It is dinner time here, yes. 8.30, I mean, it's a little late to eat dinner. Um, okay, let's put Ryan in the baby carrier and then you can go and just hold him pick up dion okay perfect totally mom mode look at her i love it she's got her babies look at that so cute oh by the way the reshade preset is happy plum bob i'm still deciding if i if i want to use this one this is like the default version I was gonna make pasta, but I, oh, yes, inspiration. Okay, we're gonna grab, there's no table here, which is kind of tragic. I was gonna say we could go to like the bench. I put the cake on the bench, but there is none. So we're just gonna put one down. How about that? Are you bumping that? I'm bumping that. Okay, go. You're going over there, and then we're gonna grab a grab a birthday cake for the babies. What with this? Can I? Okay, yeah, a second. I was gonna say, can I put that in their inventory? Stay here. Oh my gosh! Just go there. Thank you. Yay! We're all here. Look at this. Look at this party little family part oh really you can't put a freaking birthday cake on the bench i'm gonna lose my shit yay why would you do that okay let's try this kind of table try this kind of table 
Maybe that'll work a little bit better. I'm gonna add another, I'm gonna move this actually. Um, put this over there. Okay, perfect. Put that there. Blow out candles. Okay, we're gonna do our air first. Do our air first because look at him with his baby carrier on. I'm dying. That's so cute. <laughs> They both have been, wait, this is such a cute family photo. I wish, I wish you could see the one in her carrier though, a little bit better. It's kind of hard to see. Why are his eyes like that? Why are his eyes? This is scary. <laughs> Sir, please. Yeah, I'm going to do another fall cozy stream. We'll, we're going to be doing that pretty, coming up here pretty soon. I'm trying to wait like further into fall so I'm not like jumping the gun a little bit. Okay, wait, this is a cute photo too. <gasps> Our little family moment. I wish she was looking, girl, please. You're ruining my photo. Come on. Just like look at me. Thank you. Looks like he hasn't had any sleep. I mean, it makes sense. They have triplets. Family picnic literally. I wish you could see the baby carrier a little bit from the front, but it's it's chill. It's chill. Pumpkin lattes. Okay. So we're going to age up our heir at the birthday cake because that's really the only person we care about. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're going to keep the gay heir idea. Yes. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Because we have to do a uh, engineer baby anyway, so. Like this is a good opportunity because otherwise we do biological kids for this like we have so far. Is this like fish eye view? The one crying is giving pick me. <laughs> I'm dead. Okay, mo first Mocha was a pick me. Now, <laughs> now this one on the back is. How'd you choose Dion? Because when he grows up, he's the cutest. That's how. I like how he's putting the baby on the ground. The baby is horizontal, y'all. The baby is horizontal. Baby is full horizontal. Why wasn't she loading in? That was so weird. Okay, come on. Age up already, please. Look at this dome. Isn't it beautiful here? Like, wow, what a beautiful birthday vista. Yeah, he has He has uh, his mom's green hair. Why, where, did, where did Gabriel just run off to? Sir! Sir, he's on his iPad as his baby's aging up. At least mom's celebrating. <laughs> like, what the heck? Okay, he's cross-eyed per usual. May life like this with triplets never find me. Literally. It's, it's just too much. Okay, then we're going to age up. We're going to age up. So you need to take him off your back and age him up. Pick up Ryan. And then you need to pick up Lion. And then we're going to be, yep. Okay. There we go. Perfect. 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 Grab a slice and grab a slice. Look at even Eleanor Alto is here to grab a slice of cake for this beautiful. Look at this beautiful sunset outside too. Beautiful lunar lakes. Where's the sun at? It's very cloudy. I guess there's no sun right now. I have some cake. Perfect. Everyone's aging up. So this little brat, you can age up, sir. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Age up, please. Age up, please. And then I'm going to put this one in the carrier if I can. No, I can't. Okay. Um. Oh, I can feed this. Wait, I have an idea. We're gonna have you go and sit and feed baby food. Wait, oh, I think I can put this in the fridge, right? Or the inventory, yes. Sit and feed. Why can I feed him the cake? Do I need to grab a slice? Probably. Grab a slice, go grab a slice of that. Baby's gotta eat. Baby wants to have some birthday cake. Okay, this one, this one's giving pick me. This was the one, lion is gonna be pick me, everyone. He's very pick me. 
He was crying on his dad's back too. You have to pick a slice first. Okay, before you can feed it to a toddler. Sweet Simmer coming in clutch with her own mod. Such a, such a flag, such a flex. <laughs> Mocha 2.0, I'm dead. How did peasants in the 16th century raise 17 kids? Like for real, I'm, fe I'm feeling that right now. Okay, go put that down and then put this in the... Oh, oh, be sat on. No, don't be sat on. Wait, can you eat that? No. And it's because I'm on a public lot. Maybe it won't work. Oh, cake slice. Oh, yes. Feed him the cake. Feed him the cake. Look at him loving his son. Wait, this is so cute. Not Mocha. Mocha was a pick me. Mocha was a pick me. I'm not going to lie. Oh, the, the freaking tab cast ruins my photo. Like, why do you do this to me? We're, we'll take a picture of this side. How about? I wish, I wish, um, what's her face wasn't in the background. That's so annoying. Whee! Cute! Sweet Simmer with the amazing animations, per usual. Yeah, the tab cast actually shows in the ear. Just to, yeah, dad with his AirPods in, true. Okay, he, she's gonna feed her son some birthday cake. So cute. I'm dying. He's loving it. He's loving it. She kind of looks spooky because the shadows are like hitting her face at a weird angle. Can this thought bubble please get out of here? I'm trying to get a cute photo of him eating his birthday cake. There we go. Finally. Oh my god, I'm actually dying. This is so cute. This is so cute. I like how the cake disappears too. I mean, that's for all foods, but like, it really adds to this. Oh, but yeah, I wish there was a key to hide the thoughts as well. Wait, Sweet Summer, I just noticed that you added it so their food, it shows on their mouth when they eat it. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Oh, she kisses his head. Sweet Summer just gets it. Oh, she just teleported backwards. Okay, Cassidy. Cassidy teleporting per usual. Um, okay, he's in dad mode. He's like, I'm ready to go home, Cassidy. It's it's getting late. We need to bring these we need to bring these boys home. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna go on home. Sweet Summer ate and left no crumbs. True. True, true, true. Oh, he's sleeping in the carrier. Yeah, he's sleepy. He's tired. He is tired. So Simmer, I do wonder if there's a way to fix the the bug with the message that says like, do you want to call a babysitter or stay here because you can't leave the toddler alone? I do wonder if maybe if the game realizes that the Sim has the baby equipped in the carrier, maybe you can like suppress that message. I don't know if that would be like too... I don't even know if that's possible if the game can realize that. I mean, I would think so. If the mod is in use, then don't send that message to the player, if that makes sense. I don't know. Just I'm just wondering because it does cancel the interaction like, or it does cancel the anim um whatever, whatever this is called, the whatever the sim is doing, the action cue when that when that happens, when that when that prompt shows up. So just food for thought. I don't know. Okay, you need to put him in there. And who's on your back? Dion's in your back. So you pick up Dion. Put him in the crib. And then, perfect! Look at this! Oh, they are superstar parents. Do the no babysitter mod. From what I tested in my game, I had no more messages once I changed a bit of code and added in the other mod. No, I, I, I do not have the no babysitter mod. Do you think the air quality is good here in Lunar Lakes? Probably not. <laughs> It's like a moon, right? Oh, help Dion to sleep. Cute. So cute. What is this dog doing in here? I found my Sims use the carrier too often in places they shouldn't, like on the toilet. <laughs> on the toilet and on the massage table. <laughs> Not the baby on the toilet and the carrier. <laughs> I'm deceased. 
Oh, Enros. Wait, does Enros go here have an option for no babysitter? But I use the babysitter sometimes, though. Like, I use it sometimes when my sims are going to work. I, I have not used the gym. I think you're talking about the uh, Tree of Prosperity. We should buy that. It comes with Lunar Lake, so we might as well use it, right? Tree of Prosperity. Isn't it, like, super expensive? Where is she? Where is she? I thought it was in the skill objects. Am I wrong? Is it in hobbies? Entertainment? Where is the tree of prosperity? Where are you? Use a basketball hoop. I thought about disabling using toilets on wearing a carrier, but I kept it for convenience. <laughs> No, that 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 it, it is very convenient. Don't get me wrong, but it's just kind of funny. <laughs> it is very convenient. I'll give you that. Decor plants. I guess it is a plant. I should have looked here. Um, do I have it? Here it is. Tree of Prosperity. It doesn't have the the store object icon. It's just like, oh, my head's covering it. It's, it doesn't have it. I don't, I don't, you guys know what I mean. Um, okay. I'm gonna put it here on our front lot. So, I think if I remember correctly, this gives your sim a random skill. So, this, uh, this could either be really annoying or I guess fine. I, I don't, I don't foresee this being like something that we need to use, but we'll, 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 uh, we'll imbue it with fruit of the soul. We'll try that. I used this back in my in, uh, Into the Future Let's Play when I did that. So why is this dog constantly starving? I don't understand. She wants to master athletic. We're gonna have her go get fatigued. The forbidden fruit burst. I didn't actually, that was a really interesting fact. I did not know Enros Go Here had a no babysitter option in it. Caregivers allow active daycare. I love babies to go to be home alone. Oh, like this. I love babies such toddlers to be home alone. Hire babysitters for inactives. No. Use daycare instead of babysitters. What is that? Use daycare instead of babysitters? What does that mean? Use daycare? Like, I know the daycare career comes with generations, but what does that mean? Use daycare instead of babysitters. The generation one? Yeah, but I've never seen this happen, if that makes sense. Oh, wait, does this mean if I have... No. Oh, you have an NPC Sims have daycare. That's so cool. I didn't know you could do that with Enros. I swear, every single stream I learned something new about Enros. Oh, toddlers will, sp will spawn at their house. Oh. They disappear to daycare when you have to go to work. That's so... That's actually really cool. Cause then you can have them like gain skills and stuff while your sim is at work instead of being at home with the babysitter <clears throat> does your game lag and become unplayable too if you add more lots lots doesn't do it for me the thing that causes me the most lag is routing issues like if a sim is gets stuck in town i'll get like a thousand error messages oh my gosh she did it she did it Oh my gosh. Nice job, Cassidy. Level 10, everyone. She wants to quit her job. <laughs> Cassidy, you your lifetime wish revolves around your job, though, girly. It doesn't make sense. Muscle mommy E, I know. She did. How did you get to that? The Enros go here? I just click on the city hall, go to Enros. Then I went to go here. And under caregivers is where I just went. I think adding more sims is a lot worse than adding lots but if those community lots are like community lots that require a lot of service sims oh yeah that's a good point if you have uh any time you add more service sims that can cause lag that's a good point lord i had a sim to the toddler learning center as the daycare with enros that's so cool it's actually really interesting something i never thought was an enros even the ability to enable or disable babysitters is something I just learned today. 
You learn how to create your own service sims. You can do so much with Enerals. You really can. Okay, stop. Stop picking the baby up. Okay, so we have to teach at least Dion how to use all of the potty skills and stuff. We're gonna try and get Ryan to um, be potty trained here. I have a mom that makes the color. Like, it's so fast. Look at this. It's so cheaty. I know it's so cheaty, but I, I need it. Especially with triplets. Like, cut me some slack, guys. Okay. Oh, sadly, the game keeps pushing randoms. Isn't it with Enros? What is that? Enros mod where you can assign your own service sims. Consigner? Enros consigner? I thought that that's how you do it. Maybe it's in master control. I don't know. It's all blending together. Oh my gosh, I think he, he learns. Ooh, a register, Enros register. Yes, thank you, Philip. Yes, 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 yes. Chat, chat knows better than me. Okay, he already learned how to potty chair, which is amazing. You need to go to sleep, miss. You have work tomorrow, I think. Oh no, oh my God, she has, she has so much maternity leave off. I'm gonna take that away from her. I know because of your video. Did I say that in the video? And I'm just blanket. I mean, that video is very old. Um, I'm gonna take away all her days. Yeah, there we go. No more maternity leave for you. You will be working. You better get your back and ass up and work. For homeless, you can click on evict on the household with master controller and the game can push them to be service sims. Oh, if I wanna, if I wanna jack their house. The game can also delete them. That's that's too spooky. Oh, look at this. We have what is that? A grape of our fruit of prosperity. Wait, this could make an amazing picture. Hold on a sec. Let me see. Hi, pale dove. Look at this. Oh my gosh, this could make a sick picture. Why is he always looking up? I don't know why his eyes get stuck like that. Ooh, look at the glow. That's so cool. This does not look like Sims 3. Like this looks like, I don't even know. You ever like play the Sims 3 and be like, wow, my game does not look like it's the Sims 3. It looks like, it looks more like a game from nowadays. There's kids screaming outside my window. It's like 9 PM. Why are, why are you outside? Don't you have, don't you have a house? Oh, he's just gonna go to town on it. Okay, purr. I do that with Skyrim. It is an iconic shot of him. Okay, so he gains two guitar skill points from that. Interesting. I don't suspect that this tree will be very useful. It's you screaming. Real, sometimes it looks like The Last of Us with mods, obviously, yeah. If I were to post that on Twitter, people would be like, uh, well, it's because you have a mods for your game. Um, take off the mods and reshade and then let me know. Like, no shit. This poor dog, this poor dog, she has got, I don't know why she can't take care of herself. I don't know what it is. My pets never like take care of themselves in this game. I can't tell you why. I'm gonna get give Dion a makeover because he's our heir and I want to get cute pictures of him as a toddler. If y'all don't know what he looks like, I think he's in the thumbnail of the YouTube video, but here's what he looks like. If you had to pick one, if you had to fight one sim from this legacy in hand-to-hand -hand combat, what would you pick? Um, Dallas. <laughs> Dallas was so rude to everybody and he was like slapping his own son routing issues maybe i feel like she can get to everything though <clears throat> let's see i'm gonna give him i really want to give him like so his dad has super curly hair and then cassidy has straight hair so I feel like he wouldn't have like hair that's curly like this, like his dad has, but probably something wavy. I don't have much wavy hair. I have this, but I'm not in love with this because it's like an EA hair. Yeah, I feel like a little wavy hair. Something like this, maybe? I mean, it's not really wavy. I don't really have much for toddlers. When, when he's, when he gets older, we can, we can 
do something a little bit more accurate but for now we'll have to uh just kind of roll with this i hate these air force i mean they're really like don't get me wrong they're really high quality but they always get put on in their outfits i'm like why are you wearing air forces to bed hi Susie. the calf's background isn't it so pretty it's from nectar seller on on tumblr if y'all are interested i have the same one for uh, as you can see it has a sims 4 it's converted from the sims 4 so that's why it's like sims 4 outside but yeah i have the same one for my stylist room it's really pretty i don't know why the hell i'm doing this formal wear we'll never see that it doesn't matter i wonder what his generation's color will be i always give like the generations like a specific color i feel like orange would look really good on him maybe do some orange something orange I don't know. I'm just kind of spitballing. I'm gonna take his shoes off. Babies, I don't know why people put shoes on babies. Like, it doesn't make sense. Because like, they always take them off anyway. If you've ever been around a baby, they always take off their shoes. No matter what. Okay, mom and dad are going to bed. Actually, they want to woohoo. Why don't we do that real quick? Let's woohoo real quick. Let's woohoo. Let's woohoo. Let's woohoo. We're going to woohoo. There we go get in here nope you're gonna get back on the bed excuse me i hate when they do this musical musical bed is so annoying musical bed okay go and woohoo regular old woohoo there we go perfect now i can go back to sleep waking up in the middle of the night woohooing crazy oh he wants to get a peg box for them we can do that i kind of want to knock down this wall and give the boys like a huge bedroom like this oh yes look at that so much more space so 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 much more space and then when they get older we can do separate beds now we don't have to have bunk beds although i do like the bunk beds from the future shock set i did download those also the bunk beds from into the future are so nice the build items from into the future are much higher quality than any of the other ones i want you i want you to notice like for example with the early beds when you put them against the wall oh wait there's one specific bunk bed it's not this one but one of the bunk beds has a it like goes through the wall like the ladder goes through the wall and they'll like go up the bunk bed through the wall has anyone does anyone know what i'm talking about they go through the bunk bed up the wall it might be this this one right here from the simster store but the later packs are so the the build items are so well done that that's like not a problem i kind of want to add the super sleeper in here too because they have so much more space now we could just add it in our living room or something like that maybe in our bedroom oh yes the bedroom makes more sense super sleeper time okay so this is another sims store object and then let's see what else do i want to put in the boys room maybe i will go for bunk beds just because i mean i don't have to is there a single bed? oh these ones are so cool okay i'm definitely gonna have to go with these ones screw the bunk beds we're going with these ones it just makes sense like the future st shock stuff is coming in clutch here super futuristic okay let's get some kids toys for them i think he wanted to buy a peg box or something so we'll put that down we can buy a little teddy bear as well let's also do this and i'm gonna put a double door on this bedroom i mean this I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that actually because this looks like a double door it looks nice it looks like a laboratory but you know sims 3 is much more high poly than sims 4. have you seen the pigeons in sims 4? <laughs> the sims 4 pigeons they look so dopey okay what is this sell a bear like a celebration bear oh it's like a teddy okay cute Oh, I'm gonna get the slide too. Sweet simmer slide. Yes. Get that. Uh, this. Maybe? No? Oh, there we go. Takes up a lot of space. 
it is a slide after all slides do take up a lot of room okay here we go oh put a teddy in their inventory for the moodlet did they get a moodlet from that let's see I'll put one in dion's inventory which moonlit does he get is he to play with it what does he get is it is it this one i want to know what is what is oh they sleep with it hello teddy bear put that there we'll just we'll just display them How about that this dog's in here i'm scared she's gonna pee inside the house again oh she's sleeping on one of the beds that's so cute that's so cute Which one gets you the imaginary friend again? What do you mean? Which one gets you the imaginary friend again? I love that feature. Which one gets you the imaginary friend again? That one, it gets shipped to your house through the mail. You can probably use Enroll's debug enabler to spawn them in all honesty, but I'm not sure. He put it in their inventory when the parents put them in there they'll get the generate they'll get a moodlet oh yeah the generation from generations expansion is the imaginary friend one was it generations i delete them because they just cause a whole bunch of routing problems when the kids grow up to children okay we need to get mom and dad up because the kids are losing their damn minds so let's Let's fix this situation. Honestly, it's kind of just Dion that is freaking out. So maybe we'll just take care of him. I say as the other kid is screaming his brains out. Okay, let's fix this problem. Put him down. Go and put Lion on the floor as well. And then... Oh no, she's trapped. Go teleport. They trapped her in the corner. I always just... Wait, does Ch is that what Chekhon does? I guess I never tried it. He barked at. I think we need to hang out with our dog. <laughs> we need to take care of our dog. Okay, just go go put him on the... Go put him on the slide. Show to Dion. Oh my gosh, look at the pointing! That's so cute. Okay, put him down. Dog needs some needs some TLC. Oh look, she was chewing, she was chewing her toy. No, don't put him in there. Put put him down. Why is this kid crying? Oh, he needs his diaper changed. Okay, change your diaper. Uh, why don't you come over and go and take care of the dog? Is that store radio thing? What what store radio thing? Store radio thing. Put lion there. And you need to use and go and eat something. Night alert. Oh my gosh, the dog did not like that. Reinforcement praise for being non-destructive. Reinforcement schooled for being a piggy. Don't be a piggy. Oh, the one that rings it's the it's the baby the baby monitor yes i know what you're talking about okay rub belly that's fine but you brush her too you wanted to brush her all right take care of her i want to get the kids i'm gonna i'm gonna go to enroll's relativity again and just set it to default again because i don't want to prolong the toddler life stage that sounds terrible because i want it to be i want it to be snappy i want it to be short we're also gonna teach the babies their skills if we can right now i think today yeah today's sunday why don't we go outside like why don't we go out to the well, here put him which one is this honestly dion is our heir so i want to make sure he learns everything first i'm gonna put dion in the carrier no no no, no don't 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 okay fine pick pick him up oh okay or put him in the car oh my gosh okay pick up dion take dion with you come on 
And we're gonna go to the park. Let's just go to the one next to our house. Seasons Festival. It's gonna be fall in our game, which is interesting. Cassidy's eating. Oh! <gasps> Cassidy's praying again! Oh my gosh! They were having such a hard time conceiving and now they're like having triplets she's pregnant again like what is going on i guess it's prediction time hell no oh my gosh prediction time everyone prediction time i can't believe i can't believe it's happening again that's crazy Fertility problems. I, it's the fertility treatment she got. Now she just can't stop getting preg. Okay. He's got so... Look at all these babies he has. That's so cute. The Sim Orphanage is going to get a bright new start. Why is he in his underwear? Please change it. The, both babies are in their pajamas. Really? You couldn't change them before you brought them to the park, dad? Really? Just bringing them in their PJs. Okay, there we go. All right, let's get a picture of him hanging out. He's got one kid on his back. He's got one kid flying around in the air. It's actually really cute. He's on dad mode right now. If she has a girl this time, would you make her the heir or keep Dion? I think we're gonna keep Dion. I think we're gonna keep Dion. I like the idea of alternating between male, female, male, female heirs. Just to switch, keep it, you know, switch it up. Okay, we're gonna teach Dion how to walk. Learn Lakes is really pretty. This reshade is going crazy. Like, it just looks so nice here. All right, we're teaching him how to walk. And then we're leaving Cassidy. Oh, she's gonna bomb. Make sure there's no apple pancakes. True. True, true, true. I don't wanna, I don't wanna. There, there's watermelon but i'm gonna toss those i want it to be even we have a freezer bunny in here freezer bunny inside the house we're gonna toss these watermelon pancakes toss up both of them there we go maybe move maybe the move to the moon made her more fertile yeah it was the climate you know <laughs> the climate right, we're gonna take ryan and we're gonna put him in our carrier because we're gonna go out and do some errands with the baby on our back because I just love these baby carriers so much. Like, you can go to sleep, right? Okay, can I click on him and... Oh, he's going to... Yeah, he's sleeping right now. I think it's uh, something that happens automatically. <clears throat> the food works even when it's cooked. The food works even when it's cooked. Oh, the, the, the apple and watermelons, you mean? Yes, it does. It does still influence it when it's cooked, yeah chat really wants it to be a girl i want them to have a girl too 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 much boy too much boy energy happening <clears throat> i like how he's just like chilling in the carrier that's so cute as <laughs> his dad teaches his brother how to walk <laughs> like that's adorable and we're also gonna grab some photos here because i do upload these listen i do upload these on the family tree Look at, look at this family tree. All right, I'm gonna show you guys. Every photo is uploaded here. So y'all can look at them. Like, I love that this is a part of the Sims tree because then you guys can view them too. You can s literally see every part of Sage's life. Like from the last time Clem got to hug Sage up until the first picture we ever took of Sage. You know what I mean? It's like that Sims 4 pack coming out life and death life and death <clears throat> feels like the intro of up yes it does it's so wholesome anyway i love that they have like cloud storage on the sims tree that's probably my favorite part of it i'm not even i'm not being paid to advertise sims tree i just like it, it it's really nice that i can upload those photos on there Hi, Maya. Okay, I'm going to make sure we don't buy any, um, what's it called? Watermelons or apples because I don't want to influence the baby at all. 
the gender of Cassie's baby. She got 30 simoleons off of her order, which is really nice. And we're going to put all of our harvestables away. And then we need to repair the whatever this thing is. Stereo. Yeah, she's flying with the baby carrier. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Imagine being that baby midair. <laughs> I wish my mom flew me around. Wouldn't that be fun? Okay, Dion just learned to walk. So we're gonna have him swap out and teach Lion how to walk now. Talking about Sims 4, the new pack is called... I'm not even gonna try and pronounce it in Portuguese. Which literally means one foot in the grave and it's used an expression for something that is past its prime flipping except or flopping. That's Sims 4 in a nutshell right there. That's ironic. Okay, put you're gonna put Dion in the carrier now. Put Dion in there and then teach him how to walk. It's actually really nice that we're micromanaging this like this. You can just put the baby in the carrier. It's so helpful. Like it really is so helpful. It'd be so cute if the air actually wanted to become a fairy or something. Would well, that be fun? Lion is a cute name. We have Ryan, Dion, and Lion. Ryan and I guess Ryan and Lion. I guess the spelling is the only kind of kind of joke there. All right, Cassie's gonna. Oh my gosh, she wants to woohoo with him again. Girl, this is why you are pregnant again, woman. This is why. Why is the pumpkin not going in the fridge? That's confusing. I just realized she's going to have multiples again, probably because she has fertility treatment, meaning we're going to have multiple sets of multiples. <sighs> I don't know how to feel about that. I don't know how to feel about that. Hopefully I can get the toddlers all their skills learned by the end of stream today so we can be on our way. If, if, if I spend 50K on socks, can I choose the gender they be? No, Lord. It's a gander. I have a nanny. We could have a nanny. I would have to build another room, though. I would have to build another room. After I just deleted and opened up the boys' room. I, and they need it, though. Like, that room is small. That room is so, so small. I'm glad I opened it up. Now that we have Cassidy's two sons in boarding school, we'll kicked them out casually. Casually. I should link the family tree. Let me link that in chat just because i keep trying to reference it and did you finish it oh she did finish it how do i give it back to him sweet simmer thank you for the five gifted the queen sweet simmer has gifted five subs thank to you so much sweet simmer means a lot okay can i put these freaking books i hate i one thing i cannot stand isn't there a button to put them all in the bookshelf did i come up with that Oh, put away books from family inventory. Thank God that exists because there was like 15 freaking books in my family inventory. We're gonna, we're gonna grab, what is his name? <laughs> I can't keep the baby straight. Ryan? Yes, Ryan. Bye, sweet simmer. Thank you for the five gifted. I appreciate it. Thank you for coming by as well. Do you plan kicking on the two other twins to, f wait, what did that say? Uh, do you plan on kicking out the other two twins to focus on the air? No, I'll be, I'll be fair. Listen, just, um, just because they're brothers of our air, we're gonna, we're gonna keep it, we're gonna keep it cordial. We're gonna keep it cute. Okay. We're gonna be, we're gonna be nice. Hi, filthy casual. Okay. Lion just learned how to walk. Amazing. Oh wait, do you mean the ghost boys? Yes, the ghost boys will be get will be kicked out. I thought you meant I thought you meant the um triplets. Okay, you're gonna go home now. I'm gonna go home. He's on dad mode right now. Look at him. He's got one on his back, one in his hands. Yeah, the triplets. We're gonna keep the we're gonna keep the triplets. We'll keep the triplets. Uh we're just not gonna keep Oh my gosh, this is driving me crazy. Your on call ba What? What? Why did they get teleported? I'm confused why they got teleported. Why did they just get teleported? They were, they were, he was bringing them with him home. No, I don't need you. 
I don't need you, sir. Trust, I'm home. I'm home for good, I promise. We do need to return this stereo to this kid. I like how Cassidy's wings are like clipping through the baby. Okay, we're gonna go home. Can I go home, please? Game, let me go home. Okay, if we're gonna keep using the babysitters, we may actually have to disable the babysitters because this message keeps, keeps popping up. Let me go home, please. Let me go home. I wanna go home. All right, how about go there? No? What? It's in like a, okay, we're just gonna teleport. We would have been home by now. We would have been home by now if the game wasn't, if the baby carrier wasn't like glitching out. Okay, let's go here. And we are going to, what is this? You can, you need to bring them upstairs. Go pick up Lion. We're gonna put them in the crib because I just, I don't wanna, I don't wanna be bothered. No, you, what is this one's name? I can't keep them straight, Ryan. Okay, Ryan, put in crib. Cassidy's preg again, I just, I, uh, just, uh, I don't know how to feel about it. I feel like she's gonna have boys again. No, why did you just put, oh my gosh, please, 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 please. Pick him up, please pick him up, please. Oh my gosh. Talk, don't talk to him. Put Dion in there, please, oh my gosh. Keep, they keep grabbing the babies. They keep grabbing the babies. I'm gonna, I'm gonna relax. Okay, I'm gonna take deep breaths, Maddie, deep breaths. I also hope it's not more than one for my own freaking sake. Why is this kid not doing anything? What are you doing? Oh, he's, okay, no, he's, he's doing something. He's feeding them. Okay, I'm okay with that. That's okay. As long as, as long as he's feeding them, I don't care. Oh, uh, honestly, the extra help is kind of nice right now. Kind of happy the babysitter got glitched over because <laughs> I am struggling to keep up with these children. I am. I am. Loki, we might total. I I'm sorry to say we might do a total annihilation if we have multiples because I don't think. <laughs> I don't think we can handle it. The, yeah, the babysitters always have crazy outfits. Like, why did this man just roll up in a tuxedo to take care of triplets? Like, sir. <laughs> sir. Why are you here in a tuxedo? He's decked out. I can guarantee you she will have multiples. Oh, I know. I know because she has fertility treatment, of course. <clears throat> I mean, in Sims, women have rights. True. Women's rights. Okay, mom and dad are going to bed. Crazy, crazy day. Oh, and she is going to vomit. Breastfeeding mom and simological. I've, I've heard of that. I didn't. I never see anything about it though. Like I never saw anyone cover it. So I wasn't sure if it was like functional with the current version of the game or I don't know. It's like the, um, what is the other mod? Like the hospital overhaul. Do y'all remember that mod where it like added a lot of stuff regarding like pregnancy and ultrasounds and stuff like that. That mod will actually corrupt your game if you have it because it's not the current version of The Sims. That's that's what I thought was up with that Simological breastfeeding mod, so. What do they do for a living? I forgot. So Cassidy's in professional sports and Gabriel is a doctor. I've heard that there is a new hospital mod. Um, I can't remember why I didn't download it though. There was a reason. I can't remember why though. Maybe I was like scared after the other mod that completely like bugged out my save. Oh, enhanced hospital. Yeah, it doesn't have everything hospital overhaul does though. I figured, but I still keep downloading the hospital overhaul. Yeah, hospital overhaul is so amazing. Like, I wish it was, I wish it was updated and it actually worked. The last time I played with it, it actually corrupted my save. Like nothing was, um, 
nothing was working when i clicked on the hospital my my game would i think it was crashing or something like that every single time i clicked on my hospital so it was really bad it was really really bad i can't remember if i fixed the save or not i think it was one of my stream saves actually it was a while ago he wants to woohoo with cassidy are we surprised oh she's gonna get her bump yay there we go how out of date is it pretty out of date to the point that it will actually break your game they just got sent the same stove that's crazy same exact stove from the same exact manufacturer i guess we can put it out here look at this little back porch area cute i'm gonna sell the other one i know someone does need to pick up the mods i need to try out vile ventures too i've been meaning to i've just been so busy with school starting what would you do for fall this year back to the crumble bottoms i feel like i want to do something different like i maybe i'm thinking of taking this family to moonlight falls wouldn't that be fun if we use enros traveler to take them to moonlight falls or something like that during the fall season wouldn't that be fun i want to do something with this family though veronaville fall like in the sims 2 i think i want to do a sims 3 fall series that's what i'm leaning towards teach to talk why don't you teach him how to potty ryan oh did he he, he already knows yeah 2012 like for me moonlight falls is ultimate fall vibes so that's why i want to play moonlight falls in the sims 3. oh sims 3 veronaville i've never tried that last part overhaul broke my save system and makes five copies of every save i had yeah <laughs> it it did it did funky things to my game as well i was like actually traumatized by that mod <laughs> every time i download core mods now i'm like very hesitant like mods that are very are deep in that go deep in your save files i'm very very hesitant to do that now because of the trouble that that mod gave me look at him taking care of pinky so cute nothing like a man and his dog a hot man and his cute dog more like you know what i'm saying what if you recreate twilight with those households inspired that would be fun i feel like i've done that before sometimes i will download mods from all the sims and not actually install them out of fear literally this game is already so finicky as is it's uh yeah Only falls could be a way of getting cute sims for genetics for the legacy right the town has a lot of good looking sims like what is that guy what is that guy's name he's based on alcide from um true blood what is his name um alcide sims 3 sim what is his name it's uh He's got like body hair. We pursued him before. It's gonna moonlight, moonlight falls Sims. It's right. It's on the tip of my tongue. It is on Gladstone Farmwell. Yes, Gladstone Farmwell. For, that guy has amazing genetics. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Here he is, the man, the myth, the legend himself. This guy is based off of uh a character from true blood alcide hervo who is based off of, is right here joe manginelli i think is how you say his last name he was married to sofia vergara who you probably know um but yeah he's based on he's based on him from true blood i love the fact that moonlight falls has so many like supernatural show references it's amazing yum literally <laughs> yum i love joe manginelli too because he plays D, D. he has like a whole table for D, D at his house it's amazing he's not that hot without his facial hair though i think you're right i don't know why but i think i remember that didn't we didn't we test that on didn't we have one of his kids or something i can't remember you're gonna use the you're gonna use the not so routine machine 
I'm putting this thing to work. Like, we spent good money on this thing, and honestly, the best part about it is that it teleports your sim to work. I don't even care about the fact it, like, lets them shower. The the animations for the shower is too long, I think. Like, he's, st he's still going. He's gonna be late for work at this point. Fall festival! Didn't we say we wanted fall vibes? I guess this town is, like, I set, I set it to be really warm. Although it's only, I mean, it's 59 Fahrenheit, which is pretty nice. Oh, it broke. No, did he get there? Um, Gabriel looks around in surprise, unsure if this is a dream or a real. Oh, no. Walking in the deep forest of the dreamscape, Gabriel hears a wolf like cobble and gets an overwhelming feeling that he's being watched. Suddenly, Gabriel sees a pair of glowing eyes in the distance. What does he do? Uh, sing a soothing song or start a fire with sticks. I don't know what, what would be in character for him. Maybe sing a soothing song. The wretched moaning calls a song is so terrible it soon wakes him from the dreamscape. What? So that is he gonna is he gonna get teleported to work or not? Oh yes, he is. Okay, good, good, good. Yeah, Moonlight Falls was listening. She was she was listening to us. Gabriel's like horrified from whatever he just encountered. Failed at VR. Why did he go into VR? What? That's such a weird... That's such a weird outcome for that. That's very odd. Silent Hill is calling. Um, okay, so she's... Wait, oh, she has like so many days off. Oh, medical outreach. We can go do that. Go, to, go do some medical outreach at the school. We're all for... We're all for medical education here dr earth song that's what they call him dr earth song i love that that's such a cute last name like i'm so glad we took cassie's last name shallow shallow as a last name was just not it you know it wasn't cute it wasn't it wasn't doing anything for me okay earth song earth song is much better much 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 better i like that one quite a bit I also have four messages on Tumblr. <clears throat> Why do I have so many messages on Tumblr? Gabriel's task with holding a seminar on the need for proper medical attentiveness, both on and off the job. It's time to educate all those eager young employees about their health benefits. Oh, okay. Be fun to do a Sabrina the Witch themed fall playthrough. I've never seen Sabrina, Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Oh, she's got a baby in the baby carrier. She's got a baby in the baby carrier. They're just like addicted to using this baby carrier. I'm actually startled. <laughs> Why is this toy floating, by the way? Oh, the doggy brought us a newspaper. I really love some but I have a laptop that crashes with one Wikipedia tab open. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure it'd explode if I open Sims 3. Oh my gosh, look at her wearing this ball gown. I was really worried about downloading the stress. I saw it on Tumblr, that's where it's from. It's a beautiful wedding gown, don't get me wrong, but every single time a Sim gets pregnant now, they always wear this wedding gown. Loki might need to take that piece of CC into some into Sim PE or something and disable it for pregnant because she keeps wearing a ball gown. Literally my mom's laptop lagging with Excel. Oh, this is a cute fall look. Oh, this is cute. Wait, I love this like Sherpa material. Oh, that's so cute for fall. Oh, yes. Cassidy Slay. Oh my gosh, I need to put her in some like knee high socks or something. Oh, this is so cute. It's a little bit too, like, gothy, I feel like. I feel like she's more of a... Someone who wears bright colors, you know? I also downloaded these frilly socks from Tumblr. So, oh my gosh, look at the Doc Martens. They have the little tongue on the back where you can pull them up. I have some Doc Martens downstairs. Christian Girl Autumn, is that what the outfit's giving? We're gonna make her socks green because you know me, when I have a green sim, their their personality becomes the color green. If the baby's a girl, she yeah. shall be named Haley. Spelled in the most obnoxious way possible. 
There were some hard questions in that last round, but Gabriel managed to get them get them through well enough. Nice. Okay. Our house is so small, I feel like. It is cute though. Like this is a really cute house. I like I like it. It's got a good layout. Actually, this is one of the best EA houses I think I've seen, to be honest with you. The, the size of this house is perfect. It's not like, you know when they EA makes a build sometimes and it's the house is like huge and then they have like two objects in the house. This house does not have that problem. It's really nice. It has tons of objects, fills up the space nicely. I will say the out, outdoor courtyard here is a little bit empty. I <laughs> need a little, little help. But other than that, this is one of the better houses. I'm glad we lived here because I really like it. I'm looking for seasons objects. Did she finally have the babies? She did. She had three boys, but we're having more. More are coming. I'm going to add a bar outside, I think. I think I want to do that. Hi, hello. Can I put this down? Hello. Why is it like momentarily green? There we go. Um, just change the colors on them a little bit, I guess. And I want to add who is wait, move objects off. We're going to add a what? Oh, that's a bug. Another day, another moment where I find a bug. Obviously, it's because it's a circular pool, but like, why can't I place it here? That's seems like it should be able to be placed here. Yes, another sh another child, E-Bean. Another child. She was having fertility issues for the longest time. That's no more. She is, um, she is thriving. I wish this pool bar could be put down too. Even though I, I just wa I got on chat, I want to watch Megan and RMS new music video. If I leave, will you be back? Yes, yeah, we'll be live. Stream doesn't end for a while. Okay, he made 200 million. Go back to work. Oh, RM. RM. Oh, Megan. Yeah, I, I saw it on Twitter. His rap has wasn't his rap good. People on Twitter were saying he actually he's he's good. He's I mean, I know he's a good rapper. I used to be a BTS fan for a long time. <sighs> okay, not dealing with this again. Come on. <laughs> Please just put the kids down and feed them. I'm gonna lose. Oh my god, I hate when they go all the way down the stairs. Now, because now, oh my gosh, no way you're going outside to feed this child. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? Everything is falling apart. She's pregnant again. We're having more kids. I, I just. Paris Hilton has a new song. I heard, I know she's a DJ. I don't know that she like, is it like a EDM song or a, I don't know, some sort of DJ-esque song. My Sims do that all the time. It's so frustrating. It really is frustrating. Oh my gosh, please. I can't wait to see. She's going to have multiples. She's going to have multiples because she has fertility treatment. It's just like, it's inevitable at this point. Oh my gosh, he's getting, we're getting promotions. New he's a neurosurgeon. He's one off of being a level 10. We're almost there, everyone. We're almost there. He has to read his research books. Hi, hi, Elvira. Okay, we're gonna read, what is it called? Gabriel Ursong's Medical Journal. Okay, that's easy. That's easy enough. Can you read it on the Tabcast? He can. I've never tried this. So the, the doctors are supposed to read these medical journals. I never have them do it, but if I remember, I do it. I wish they, I just wish they read them more autonomously because I always forget. Okay. Why do you have this child on your back? That's my first question. Second question is why is Ryan not in his crib? Is this the first September stream? Is it? E yes, it is. Last time was the 31st of August. So yes. It is. Um. Okay. Let's change the diaper of this child. 
that needs to sleep that's gonna use the super sleeper let's use this object out super nap there we go needs a little nap cassie's got a baby on her back one outside this is just a mess absolute mess um what is this tickle dion isn't he in your arms let's get rid of that want right now we can just have her tickle him tickle and then you can i'm gonna have her go upstairs and put him down up here so that he has stuff to, to do objects to use cassidy wants to go outside and relax in the pool lounger that's funny rest and relaxation oh my god she's gonna use the toilet with the baby care <laughs> Hey, Sweet Simmer did say she left it in so that <laughs> for convenience. I I appreciate that. Um it is interesting though to see the Sim use the baby <laughs> on the toilet. Oh, Gabriel's on call today. Okay. That's fine. Hi Simbas. You have Twitch? I do have Twitch. I've had Twitch. That's weird. I was texting someone. I need to rest and relax as you said that. I think the futuristic toilets have bidets because like Sims don't wipe. They don't wipe. Isn't that strange? They must. They must. Or they just or do they just walk around letting it crust. Either one, you know? Either one. And he wants to hug Cassidy. Okay, he read his. He had his um medical journal can i i want to get i want to get what i want to get best friends with this dog so i get rid of this not crust baddie <laughs> you just sims 3 wipe your ass mod what did i just read no <laughs> are you almost friends with this dog eh, not even ethan thank you for six months Thank you. Oh, Ethan just subscribed. Oh, Ethan. Isn't it all Ethan? Why'd she, why'd she read it all Ethan? Sweet Sarah, come back. <laughs> Are most of the Sims 3 mods on Tumblr because Mod The Sims is always so dry with Sims 3 content? No, I'd say Mod The Sims is probably the best place. Uh, Tumblr has a lot of clothes and hair and stuff like that i wouldn't say mods though i mean people post their mods on tumblr don't get me wrong can i resub while you're offline yes it should let you it won't play the notification but i mean obviously <laughs> but yeah you can i can't believe how i'm not i'm actually not like freaking out this time about having to take care of all these kids i'm i'm juggling it pretty well i mean i don't want to toot my own horn but like normally i'm like freaking out and just irritated and ready to be done with all these kids but something about this time around it's not so bad it really is not it's going pretty well comparatively all right you need to potty train dion so the mod i have potty trains them it potty trains them on the first time they sit down which honestly it's very cheaty but i don't give a shit i played the game i played this game since i was nine years old i've seen the i've done the trials and tribulations of the vanilla potty training and i just can't i just can't it's way too long it takes so long especially when you have multiples like most of my sims have multiples nowadays oh gosh oh he didn't he didn't learn on the first try oh okay that's embarrassing i thought it was always on the first try it's a full moon. Oh, she could have had a baby on a full moon. And then we could have gotten. Oh, she's gonna woohoo with her husband. Okay, go ahead. Oh, never mind. She's gonna vomit instead. Loki, we need a maid. I'm gonna hire a maid. We're rich anyway. I just hope that it doesn't cause rotting problems. A little cheese to make them use a potty chair when their bladder need to slow. Yeah, I, I, I do that too, but it still takes forever. All right, we're gonna call a maid. Idea of multiple scares and I can't take more than five sim household. I I also don't like when my households are too cluttered. It 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 stresses me out. 
I thought of woohooing makes her want to vomit apparently. Oh, and my game auto saved. I don't know why sometimes it asks me if I'd like to save and then other times it just like saves it. Maybe I almost feel like it's if my sim doesn't have something. Maybe that's it. If you don't have something in the queue, it just saves the game then and there. If you have something in the queue, it, it asks. No, because she has something in the queue. I don't know. I don't know why sometimes it sometimes it asks, sometimes it doesn't. Housekeeper mod. How does that differ from a maid? Like, what is the difference? Auto saving without permission, literally. That's that's what that's what Enroll Saver does to me. Just saves without permission. It's like, all right, saving your game now. Don't care. Oh, the housekeeper lives with you. I had a seven Sims household that in that starter two bedroom house in Sunset Valley, obviously upgraded. Is it the one that is got the um, is it the green one or is it the one that has like the darker colors? Because I think there's multiple two bedrooms in Sunset Valley. Oh, it's the green one. Oh, I know what you're talking about that. Yeah, that's the that house is notorious. Everyone's lived in that house. It was kind of glitchy when I got when I when I use it though because I got a new housekeeper every single day. Oh no, that would send me over the edge. I couldn't. Oh look at him walking down the street with his baby. Oh he's kind of cute. Oh this is um this is one of the Sekimotos from this is one of their relatives from Sunset Valley. You know. Also I'm using a different reshade. I think I said that, but last time we were using Slap Happy, and that's let me show you the difference here. That's what this looks like. It's very pretty. Don't get me wrong. Very bright. Oh, no. We're getting aliens or not aliens. Zombies. Sorry. Anyway, that's what slap happy looks like. And then let me see. Then we have happy plum bob, which is I really like happy plum bob. Honestly, this is default happy plum bob too. I, I oh, no, maybe I did change something. No, this is this is default. Yeah, this is default. I left all the settings like how it comes because everyone always asks if I can upload the one that I tweaked. And I'm like, I don't know if I should be doing that because I didn't make the original preset. It was kind of like a gray, gray, gray area. But look at her cute fall outfit. Oh, the maids here at 12 a.m. Amazing. I did notice the turnover with the housekeepers. I don't think it stands out too much. It might do something behind the scenes though. Yeah, aliens are base game. No, wait, no, aliens were with seasons. Aliens came with seasons, yeah. Um, okay, all these kids need to sleep. Or eat, I mean. Oh, she keeps getting stuck in this corner. Why must you get stuck in that corner? Go use the potty chair, sir. I'm gonna have her go and eat some autumn salad. We're not influencing the baby's gender this time. Let's go. We're having autumn salad after autumn salad after autumn salad. We're gonna use a super sleeper too. I never use this. Oh, he's already done cleaning. Okay. I don't know why he came at midnight. That's kind of crazy, but I'll take it. I'll take it. How's the dog? She's doing well. Go eat like the pets never eat out of their bowl like they're always oh he's got an emergency get up get up get up go to work quick there's a medical emergency no don't make the bed there's a freaking emergency why are you doing that no gabriel oh my goodness oh my goodness the baby's last name is january that's so cute what a cute name or last name i mean gabriel does not have enough urgency in his step right now like he needs to go perform emergency neurosurgery and he's just like taking his sweet damn time. I also want to buy them a car considering they're rich. We should probably do that, right? I'm going to put this fairy house uh, like back here, I guess. I don't know. I'm going to put the portal back here. Move some of this. How is this object in use? Oh, is it because it has fruit on it? Probably. I'm going to... Into the future car. Wait, is there a car from Into the Future? Oh, there are. There are tons of them. Can I put them anywhere? No, I can't. Do they go in a regular? Do they go in a regular parking spot? The 
We could do the wing carver. I think this is a separate skill though, isn't it? Ah, uh, I might just, I might just slap down a parking spot in like a terrible position and then just drag the car to their inventories because I don't really want to, ooh, look at this one. I don't really want to uh, have the parking spot right here. It looks very stupid. <laughs> We're gonna get her this one. We're gonna get Cassidy, the one with the with the back seat, because she's she's got on she's got kids, you know? We're gonna give her a nice mint color. A nice mint color car. I'm gonna have her go there. And then what color was his? I think it was just black. We'll keep his we'll keep it a nice sleek color because he's a doctor, so I feel like that's that makes sense. That tracks, right? It is hailing here right now. I didn't know it hailed in Lunar Lakes, but you know, here we are. <clears throat> All right, we're super sleeping. And then she needs to go repair this. No, you know what? We're gonna wake her up mid super sleep. Have her go repair the not so routine machine because it is just broken. Oh no, she's repairing with a puddle underneath her. Isn't that like, don't they get electrocuted if that happens? Oh, okay. No, never mind. She's perfectly fine. Maybe it hails diamonds. That's that's true. It could be like hailing some 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 super nice material or, or something like that. Okay, Gabriel just got out of his emergency. We're gonna have him go head home. He's gonna use a super nice car. Oh wow. That is so fast. He's like teleporting around town. Holy, what is the speed? Hold on a sec. We need to check the speed on this car. 10 speed? Don't like a bunch of other cars also have 10 speed? No. That's like one of the only ones. Where's Cassidy? What does the one I bought for her have? 6 speed. That's terrible. No, it's even worse. That's 5 speed. This town is hostile to pedestrians. That is crazy how fast he was driving. Let's have him go pick that fruit. What is that one? It's green. What is the green? Probably like, I don't know. Let's see what it is. What does he get? What's he got? What skill did you gain? Fishing. Fruit of the harvest is what that is. Okay, cool. Guess we'll just, every time we see it, we'll just keep, uh, we'll just keep plucking them from the tree. I'm going to put her... Very house closer up. The crystals are giving Sims for it is. It is actually. It is giving Sims for. He needs to use a super sleeper because he has work in like so short of an hour. So short hour. So short time. This kid, what are you lying? You need to go to bed, sir. Post clan consequences. I'm traumatized for from fishing. Same. Same. Oh my gosh, same. I never wanna, I never wanna fish again. That took so long. Like it was just terrible. Oh my gosh, that was terrible. That was, that was the hardest skill we've done yet. That was the hardest generation so far. I hope the other ones aren't like that. Cause that was actually so painful to get through. Gabriel has work soon. He's gonna use this. Oh, he actually got a lot of sleep from that super sleeper and he's getting teleported over, which is nice. Look at that. All the futuristic objects I'm using and I'm actually liking them more than I remembered. She wants to hug him amorously. Fishing is not a go-to skill. It's not. It's just, why didn't she flush? Are you slob? No, why didn't she flush when she... Wait, this toilet doesn't flush, I guess, from the future shock set? Oops, I didn't mean to have her quit. I meant to have her ignore the call. Watch Argyle Sinclair. No. Is Clem old? Have we had her visit yet? No, Clem is not in this town. Um, I used Enros Porter, so she's... She's uh, not going to be... We're not going to be able to see her again. But, you know, when she was about to be an elder when we left her, so... I think she would probably be probably halfway through her elderhood right now, if I had to guess. If I had to guess like what her age would be in relation to how far we've played. She's chilling in Hidden Springs. 
yeah we, we left her because she had too many kids she had way too many kids i didn't want to deal with it i was honestly after the whole fishing debacle i was like i'm done with playing clem i just can't i just can't do this anymore i was over i was over her i was over playing her mm -mm. Clem, Clem can keep her drama on Sim Earth, true. Yeah, she's 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 back somewhere. Or you know what? Maybe she did move. You know what I mean? Maybe she moved out of Hidden Springs because it had bad memories or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This child. Okay, you can just teach him his skills. Teach to talk. Which one is this? I can't tell him apart. When do they age up? Two days, jeez, that feels like forever. Dog keeps bringing me a newspaper. I like that, buddy, thank you. But I'm trying to do something right now. Maid's here. Yeah, she moved to Sunlit Tides for retirement. That's that's a good, uh, that's a good, that's a good theory. I my window open, I'm cleaning and lurking, but I thought there was a storm, but I, there's a storm here, I think right now. I hear like trees rustling. It's fireworks though. Fireworks for what? Is it like a belated Labor Day celebration or something? I don't know if you're American though. I'm gonna assume you're American because fireworks. And I feel like that's a very American thing to blow off fireworks at the most random of times. <laughs> I am, yes, I knew it. I knew it. That's so on brand for Americans to just blow off fireworks randomly. Are there fireworks here too? Okay, maybe it's a Brazilian thing too. Brazil, America, you know, who doesn't love fireworks? What are you doing? Be taller, okay. Okay, okay. It's Kendi needs to use the potty chair and he's all the way downstairs. Independence Day here, but we don't have fireworks, only marches during the day. I also don't like fireworks, it's very loud. It's very loud. I like to see them, but like it gets a lot after I like seeing them from afar, okay? Let's put it like that. I don't listen, I don't like hearing the the loud noises. There was a fire alarm that went off during class on Thursday and I looked around and I obviously was plugging my ears like this because it was really loud, but like all of my classmates were just like sitting there not plugging their ears and I was so confused. I was like thinking to myself, how are you guys not bothered by the really loud fire alarm? It was so freaking loud. I don't like loud noises. I really don't. I couldn't believe no one else was plugging their ears. It was so bizarre to me. Oh my gosh. She keeps locking herself in this corner. <laughs> so she can't get out. I like how Pinky's chilling in here. Ew. She's floating. I hope the next baby she has is a fairy. Oh my gosh, I want a fairy. I want a green fairy, please. Yeah, she's about to pop. She's look how big her tummy is. She's gotta be on day three, right? She's gotta be. Gotta be day three. Stomach is popping. When did she get pregnant? I don't even know which 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 risky woohoo did it. Yeah, fair, girl fairy. Come on. I hate my mom calls my name and yeah, she. I like say what and she doesn't say anything. It's like, why are you, why are you doing this to me? It looks like four children from here. No, she's going to have multiples. She will. <gasps> Another promotion. He just got to, he got level 10. Why was there no music? There was no like celebration music. He hit level 10, everyone. Look at this. Oh, this guy's like inside of me. Alexander Cross. Okay. Look at this level 10 world renowned surgeon, Gabriel Earthsong. Yeah, surgeon Earthsong, let's go. Wow, he's making bank now. He just made like, how much was that? Like 5K? We're, we're gonna pick that fruit. Let's go, Gabe, let's go. 
Cassidy's tired. Oh, the kids are playing with their imaginary friend dolls. Oh no. Oh, Gabe got writing skill. Gabe got writing skill. Okay, we need a befriend. What celebrity is this? Oh, it was a land grab. Chris land grab. Should we go and hunt him down? Let's go hunt him down and do this quickly. We can we can get it done quick with the um deeper conversations mod. Let's go over to the land grab house. I should probably look at our goals for the next generation. We need to master science, reach level 10 of the science career, complete the aspiration. What is the aspiration? Oh, become a robot crossbreeder. Okay, cool. Uh, get divorced as an adult. Oh, get married as a young adult. Okay, so by the time he's an adult, we have to get him married. Um, get divorced as an adult. You're too busy with your career. After the divorce, you both still live in the same house. Use the clone voucher, lifetime reward, engineer a baby. This is pretty easy. It's just the science skill stuff. Someone told me that the science skill is very annoying to get. It can't be, it cannot. There's no way it can be more annoying than the fishing. I mean, I guess the fishing wasn't, the skill itself wasn't annoying. It was the selling enough objects type stuff that was really annoying. Yeah, another married and divorce arc. Honestly, Gabe's, Gabe was pretty easy. Like it was, chat is gassy. Ethan is gassy. No, it's just Ethan. Ethan is gassing us out. Right, let's talk about occupation. Oh, he liked that. Wait, what, what, science? He likes science? The science skill is very annoying. It's just, the science skill is very annoying. But it's just levels slower than most of the other skills. Oh, does it? Talk about what skill does this man have? Logic. I am sunburned from the fair. Oh, I just I went to the fair of the when Mal was here last week too. I got sunburned. <clears throat> Aromatherapy type V, Ethan says. After three consecutive art sound effects in a row. Let's go out career. Make silly face. I missed a few streams. Is this the third world generation we're working towards? It's, we're in, we're working towards gen four right now. I just ripped, I, I remember that guy that ripped ass in front of you. Well, yes. Yeah, it was, it was disturbing. I hadn't been in Walmart in like a long time. And that was my welcome back gift, I guess. It was so, it was just tragic. People of Walmart final boss, you know, there's a stereotype and gotta say I encountered it on that day. Okay, you need a potty. What is this kid's Dion? Dion, please be potty trained. You were so close, dude. You Oh, the game's, the game's saving again without consent. Why must you do this? I mean, I guess it's fine. Just sometimes, you know, maybe I didn't want to save. I, that must be some setting or something. It normally always asks. I didn't get an auto save mod. That's just NROL saver. That's all I have. So why is it not asking me anymore? Sometimes I want to ruin progress. Yeah. I don't know why. Oh, okay, perfect. Potty trained. And then we need to teach you to talk. Gabe, please become friends with this man. You need it for a celebrity opportunity, sir. I think she got pregnant at nighttime. Because that's when they woohooed. Oh, friends. Yes. There we go. Perfect. We got 100 celebrity points. That was definitely not worth it. Whatever. I'm on the second gen of Alepacy with one of my triplets. I am scared for what her next baby is going to be because it's going to be multiples. I already know. When I downloaded and I'll save it with lag like crazy when it was loading the prompt to save. Really? That's strange. Are you allowed to get the playpen from Aurora Skies or no? Yes, that's fine. Uh, there isn't a rule about that. I just, I don't know why I'm not doing that. I have mods that make it slower anyway to teach the kids. Why are you doing this? 
sir this corner is just bugged out like i don't understand you need to get you need to get up here and change that oh my gosh of course he went down the stairs he just is trying to waste my time i fear i think what is this kid's name lion do you know how to potty train no you don't there we go okay after this he knows everything cassie's about to pee herself pregnant lady problems oh it's baby time it's baby time it's baby time go deliver the baby go deliver the baby gabriel gabriel's gonna be the one delivering it i guess he's a surgeon he's not like a a labor and delivery doctor he's a surgeon he's a world renowned i guess he can do it all if he's world renowned you know she's gonna pee herself oh no wait go take her to the hospital oh my god wait what are you two doing what oh i i clicked stay home instead didn't i oopsie she's gonna pee herself <laughs> cold babysitter i guess go 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 look at her mint green car i want a girl please yeah the first baby will determine if you guys get your points or not why did her why did her bladder stop going down i'm so confused gabriel go in your child's being delivered sir i'm so scared i'm so scared i feel like it's gonna be boys again please no more boys please please no more boys no <laughs> No. No. Boo. Boo. <sighs> it's literally a boy curse. It's literally a boy curse. Ah, I hope she has multiples. And I hope it's a one of them's a girl. Scion. <laughs> Should we name him Scion? <laughs> Let's name him Scion. Oh, ne neurotic and disciplined. Please have a girl. No, two. Are you kidding me? Two more boys. Another boy. Another one. Thank you. Ooh another one we need that sound. we need that on a soundboard another one thank you meme okay let's see one thank you <laughs> i love this i love this another one thank you another one thank you <laughs> another one thank you <laughs> another one thank you <laughs> that's me right now <laughs> Ugh, Orion. Okay. Oh, Cryon? Pronounced crying. Wait, that's so good. Is that a TikTok NPC? I, it might be. Insane and couch potato. Great. <gasps> One girl. Oh my gosh. But they're triplets. Wait a sec, guys. What if? Here's a crazy, here's a crazy idea. What if we totally annihilate the other two boys and just keep the girl? Or we could boarding school them. Either one. Maddie, no. No, that's horrible. Total annihilation removes. Okay, everyone's saying boarding school. All right, everyone's saying boarding school instead. All right, fine. We'll keep them. Um, we'll keep them. Um, Strongful. Uh. <laughs> for legal reasons she meant the sims with regards to eating the boys yeah true all right what's a what's a girl name that goes with this with this with this do you guys have one matriarchy passed down celeste celeste is cute but how does that go for like how does that how does that go in a fairy name saffron's cute celeste is really cute okay okay 
Okay, there we go. <gasps> One of them's green! Oh my gosh, and Celeste is a fairy! <gasps> Celeste is a fairy! Celeste is a fairy! No, Celeste is not green. Scion is green. But Celeste is a fairy! I think she's the only fairy in the family. She's the only family, fairy, family, fairy, fa fairy family. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I need to see what she looks like when she ages up. Oh my gosh. Addy Spice, thank you for the celebration sub. Oh my gosh. A Wait, 24 she's green? Subscribed. She is green! Wait, she's a green fairy. I'm so confused. Why does it say that the other kid is green? Wait a sec. I'm so confused. I thought the other kid... Oh, I was mousing over the wrong one. No, she is green. She's a green fairy, just like our mom. Did her skin tone change? I think it might have changed. I don't care. She's green. The game gave her green. I'm saying hashtag Celeste for air. Okay, let's see. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Are you ready? Oh my gosh, here we go. Oh, the hat is so tragic. Damn, she looks so much like her mom. Oh, her, her, she is so green. She's more green than her mom is green. Like, she's like super green. Ultra green bean. She's cute. Look at her eyes, they're huge. She's tanned green, is she? Oh yeah, she is, because her complexion's like going towards a, a darker shade of green put eyelashes all right we'll see let's see out let's see out her potential oh my gosh look at those big eyes so pretty she has like anime eyes she's so cute it's official celeste has to be air she was pretty we could do a dual air situation face card right she's giving I want to see her with like some makeup on like I want to see the potential oh my gosh she's like a princess she's literally the only girl oh I didn't mind, not mean to add that she's the only girl in her family she looks like Momo from twice I see it I see it I know her ears are pointed too just like her mom and she's a fairy like are you shitting me that's so oh she had the little stubby wings she had the tiny little where are her wings at Does, is it because i aged her? i think it's because i aged her up cute she popped out eight kids and seven of them are boys look at this look at this family tree we're no we're gonna need a bigger house before the next stream that's just a given but um, we will, oh, look at this dog just trotting by. Bridget, it's a Sekimoto dog. I don't know why Cassidy's bladder is like paused. We can do a dual air situation. Like maybe in the future we can have uh, both Dion and Celeste move out together. That'd be cute, wouldn't it? Look at him. He's he's literally wearing his uniform from work. I think he delivered his own babies. He delivered his own babies. He has even has the gloves on, y'all. Look at that. Fresh out of delivering his own babies. Challenge to the death for the air. Split save files is an interesting idea. I like the idea of Celeste and Dion being heirs. Yeah, we can do like a split air situation. Anyway, we're going to put Cassidy on birth control. <laughs> and this is going to be worse than calculus. Yeah, driving me crazy. I know. Cassidy's going on birth control though. Um, Sorry to break it to you. Uh, birth control time. She... Her doctor is like, if you have any more kids, you're gonna you're you're gonna fall inside out. Like, your uterus is gonna fall inside out. And Cass Cassie's like, okay, okay, no more babies. Oh, she put the baby in the crit or her carrier. I mean, I'm Mal. <laughs> Birth control time for Cassidy. 
she was having fertility issues isn't this what happens though like some people some people get fertility issues and then they have like a bunch of kids on accident because they like went to the doctor and they like i don't know I've, i know sto there's stories like this where people will have like not be able to have kids and then they'll go to like a fertility doctor and then they'll accidentally get pregnant like 15 times over ivf can make you have twins once your body figures it out it doesn't stop oh what is that oh are are those particles from the because she's a fairy i haven't played with fairies in so long <clears throat> i took i took the weight gain mod out but um it was too it was too it was too intense like it was i needed to be more gradual sometimes after you have one it's easier to have others she's sparkling she is i've never seen the babies the the fairy babies sparkle like that so i can't believe she's peeing. oh there she goes she's peeing herself yep oh lord we're gonna need many more bedrooms we're gonna need three more cribs i think we might for the time being just put these in here and figure the housing situation out next time maybe in the beginning of next stream we can go real estate hunting for like a futuristic-esque house because yeah she waited so long to pee herself. I know she was like for the past five hours needing to pee herself. Yeah, I'll accept a viewer submission house, of course. You're free to use. I would actually, I would actually encourage you to use the Future Shock stuff and like the not so routine machine and stuff. So if anyone wants to build me a house, let me know. If you want to build it, Philip, I am down. I am down for that. I'm gonna put Dion. Oh my gosh, this is already getting. <laughs> this is getting a lot already. This is like a massive nursery. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Luckily, the, the 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 boys only have one day as a as a kid left. So, you know. That's okay. It does look like a daycare, yes. Um, I'm just glad we have one day of toddlerhood left for the triplet boys. Any special requests except her for being futuristic? No. Just that there's enough rooms for... I guess the triplet boys could share a room up until they're like teenagers, probably. Maybe like... I don't know if five bedrooms would be too much. Two sims per bedroom. Cassidy and Gabriel one. Celeste needs her own, so there's two. Orion and Sion can be in one, so there's three. And then Dion, Lion, and Ryan can be in one. So what is that, four bedrooms? I'm raising an army. Actually raising an army. Maybe it's like, you know, maybe it's like fairies have a lot of kids, maybe in in my in my lore in my sims lore i don't know but this house is gonna need some major tlc but that will be for future maddie to figure out anyway yeah, if anyone wants to build me a house let me know because this is getting crazy i'm gonna end stream there though guys i hope you did all enjoy our lovely breeding project we have going on just kidding um sims have lots of babies in my games i guess but yeah they're rabbits that's a good way to put it um, I will catch you guys all next Saturday, hopefully with a new and improved house. A little scared about that. Sim supply into the future builds. Oh, that could be fun. All right. Bye, guys. I'll catch you all next Saturday. Bye.